check it out. What did you just say? Thanks You're on for the camera, call. you fucking tard. I don't know. You're going to do your live read. I am going to do my... Thank you. You have much respect for the art <laughs> of broadcasting. What's up, everybody? What's up, dudes? What's up? Uh, Joe Liss is in the house. Dan Soda. Hey, check this out. We're going to do this read right up front. So fuck you. <laughs> uh, do not hit the 15-second fast forward. How dare you? Do it all day, baby. Don't do it. No, don't do it. We need the money. I got to pay these fucking assholes. <laughs> I mean, don't do it. No, but, you know. Uh, uh-oh. Is that... Lewis, is he coming up? No. Oh, say can you see... What's up? Blue Apron is the leading mail kit delivery service in the U.S. That's right, by the dawn's oily light. While many people know what they do, many people don't know about the types of meals you eat when you cook with Blue Apron. Uh, excuse me, like quick bucatini with broccoli and pecorino cheese and Italian style shrimp and sweet peppers. With ingredients that are incredible and chef design recipes, Blue Apron lets you see what the power of food can do. Okay, convenience variety. Blue Apron delivers fresh pre-portioned ingredients and step-by-step recipes right to your door that can be cooked in under 45 minutes. The menu changes every week based on what's in season and is designed by Blue Apron's in-house culinary team. It's flexibility what matters. Blue Apron offers 12 new recipes each week and customers can pick two, three, or four recipes based on what best fits their schedule. High quality, Blue Apron sends only non-GMO ingredients and meats with no added hormones. It's <clears throat> unbelievable. Listen, okay? I love this thing. I cook with it. It's easy for me to cook. It comes to the door. Me, Max, and Dawn, we cook it together. The ingredients are fresh. It tells you step by step. It's under 45 minutes. <clears throat> it's delicious, all right? You have a team of professionals putting this stuff together, creating recipes each week. All right? It's unbelievable. You got to get this. If you live alone, you have a girlfriend, it's Blue Apron's doing this too. This is awesome. I love this. Blue Apron is treating my fans, you know what, dude? Listeners, to 30% off your first order. Just visit blueapron.com slash dude. So check out this week's menu and get 30 bucks off at blueapron.com slash dude. Blueapron.com slash dude. Blue Apron, a better way to cook. <laughs> if this is ever handed to me like this again, I never want to see your gorgeous face again. Oh, okay. Are you drinking a gin tonic? Yeah, gin. I'm, I'm back. Right. Dude, that would be crazy. Is this how you come off the rails? I'm off the rails. I'm going to get thin again by drinking. Oh, <laughs> sexy. Uh, <laughs> drug chic. <laughs> drug chic? Yeah. Uh, get that Kate I, Moss body. If I was ever going to do drugs, it would be pot. Okay, can you not call it pot like a cop? I want pot. (laughs) Why? Like a cop. You got any grass? You got any fucking pot on you? (laughs) I'm not a cop. I am not a cop. (laughs) Smash his arm with a timbo. Not you, not you, and not you. Not you. Uh, Lewis, what are you doing? What can I help you with? I'm just getting this. His oh, thick ass hips just keep bumping up into me. That <laughs> fucking big chubby Puerto Rican nose you He's have. Not, are you? You're in shape. Are you in shape? I'm little? sort of in shape. I'm back on keto. I'm two days in. Keto I feel week. <laughs> keto ba. Keto. You are bringing disrespect to keto. <laughs> uh, Lewis, you are a puffy snake. You got a clean shave. You're all yeah, shaved what up. What about the head? Smooth. Oh yeah. Look wow. how smooth you are. I always shave it up, dog. What you my, that's my Equinox membership. You got a Is date it? tonight? No, I just, yeah. you know I go I steam every day I shave I yeah. steam today you mean suck guys off I suck guys off Bobby yep <laughs> do you ever have a guy come up to you in the steam room every and... time almost every time that's how much I love steaming homos <laughs> homos every time uh, yeah. uh, I have to fight I gotta beat them off with a stick they closed you beat the them one off at, I the... beat them off with my dick <laughs> <laughs> the one at crunch they had to close the steam room down because it was just guys sucking sucking each other off oh man you know? I go yeah. to the steam room every day and uh, it's just me nobody bothers me I yeah they actually and... leave. Do you, oh, do you wear your glasses in there? No. Uh, the only way the glasses in the steam room should be I don't know. I thought, I thought it'd be funny if your glasses were all steamed up. I read, I would, though. I bring, uh, they, they do little printouts of the Times Digest. And do they I, get uh, all wet and goopy? Yeah, and... yeah, that's okay, but that's for the Mexicans to clean up. Hmm, all right. What are Speaking you? of getting all wet, good to see you, Gabby. It's been a while. Oh, <laughs> hey. yeah. Yeah. Gabby yeah. is a hot smoke show. Because women get wet. You like think Gabby's hot? Gabby's a fucking hottie. What are you kidding Thanks, me? Guys. Blonde bitch? Really? Blonde, Blonde bitch. All right. 
You just Jesus really took Christ. it from nice to <laughs> shitty. You really I love that you just jerk back and shit. forth. You go, oh no, she's a classic beauty. You can tell the way her bone structure is. Yeah. Bet her pussy gets nice and white. You're she's like, gotta oh. throw a nag in at the end. Oh. I think she's hot. Oh, she's white. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> is that your top <laughs> top <laughs> billing <laughs> for you? A nice porcelain doll? No, she, he said something about a nag. <laughs> I mean, that's a joke. Oh, uh, okay. He just did two uh, nag jokes in a row. Yeah. Um, welcome, Louis J. Uh, Gomez, uh, Joe List. Dan Soda back on the show. The regulars. We have uh, a couple, a few people. Can we have a new intro when it's just the regulars? Oh, well, that'd be mean? awesome. I think that's great. Can you that's guys make a special intro, intro for us? Yeah. Say some funny shit. Funny yeah. shit. All right, cool. That's, that's how the host does, you motherfucker. All right, Sometimes we're going to change people's lives here on the YKWD podcast. No. You never know. Yeah, but Don't sometimes you do. Don't play both sides of the con, dude. That's what the host's supposed to do. My name's Joe DeRose, and I'm in the intro for no reason. No, oh, I was on the show before it became this show. <laughs> <laughs> is that pretty good? Joe's in town tonight. I know. Oh. I don't know why we should have had him on the show. Oh, well. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Guess who will get a 45-minute phone call about that? Why? Dude, is Bobby mad at me? Yeah, my Joe DeRose is the same as my Bobby. <laughs> <Kelly>. <laughs> and your Bill Burr is the same yep, one. It's all the same. Do Bill Burr. Also in Dead. Yeah, go ahead. There it is. Do Joe DeRosa. Dead. <laughs> Do Bob Kelly. Dead. <laughs> uh, yeah, Joe's one of the, I mean, Joe is the reg. Yeah. I mean, he's the, he's the ridge. Can you be a, he can be in a ridge. He can be a reg. He's yeah, in a he's in a five years. I think he's in a ridge. He's in a ridge. At a ridge. You guys are the regs. Colin yeah. and Joe are the ridges. Yeah. Colin is the ridge. No, yeah. we're the regs. They're the fags. Yeah. <laughs> Softball <laughs> game. <laughs> yeah. Take that, originals. <laughs> Speaking if you're keeping uh, score recipe, we're extra crispy. Yeah. Damn. If you're keeping a score at home, uh, Lewis is at three n words, one fag. We are five <laughs> minutes into the show. Yeah. <laughs> He's He's describing the show I did last night. Lewis is his own boss. <laughs> Woo, boy. Speaking of uh, Colin Quinn, uh, God bless him. He died. That's he, fucked up, Jesus dude. Christ. God bless his soul. No, he didn't. He's up there. He didn't. Don't say that. He didn't die. He died, yeah. You didn't know that then? Then he came back. Then he died again. <laughs> then he died. <laughs> then he died. Then he came back. Then he came back. We're not, ta- we're not talking Colin about it. Colin Quinn as a not- zombie would be hilarious. Oh, he'd be like, ugh, I'm going to fucking eat your brains. <laughs> <laughs> we're, not talking about it. we're not talking about his career. <laughs> okay? <laughs> Burned him, bro. He really crushed him. Well, that would have hit the guy. first time it started, yeah. but then Lewis did a couple yeah, uh, detours on, on you. Yeah, he steps on He just steps on people. Kick him out while he's down. Yeah. This guy's almost dead. You're going to fucking make fun of him? Because Lewis is on Adderall, but he's not kicking in. No, I'm not. How you are you off it? No, I'm not. What are you off it? I'm on a different medication. What are you on now? Coke? Uh, no, doggy. <laughs> None of your business. Clonopin? Are you on a Clonopin? What are you, my doctor? I want to know. Yeah, we're your friends. We want to know. What are you on? Clonopin? No. I don't know. What are you taking? Fucking Lewis? Clonopin, by the way, knocks you the fuck out. Yeah, you yeah. should so take Clonopin. If Lewis bad. was rocking like this on Clonopin, I'd be like, you are a monster. <laughs> <laughs> what are you taking? What do you got? None of your beeswax. Come on, tell beeswax? me. Beeswax? You're taking beeswax? The new brain pill? Yeah. <laughs> yes, What's the, oh, they have that? The limitless? I have it. All right. What is it? It's, it's a, a brain, brain pill. It's a Clearly brain not pill. using it. Double high five. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> <laughs> ah, they ah, you burned him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Do you get to kick him out while he's down? He's almost I dead. I heard uh, one of the side effects <laughs> is it makes you gain a ton of weight. Did you oh, see that joke? <laughs> bloated. <laughs> oh. <laughs> bloated. Thanks, Mike. Uh, yeah, there's a brain pill. Dr. Steve talked about it. There's a brain pill. Uh, Aren't they all I brain pills? No, really? there's an actual pill. Yeah, you need a stomach pill. I don't know why you go for the brain one. <laughs> he already did that joke, you fucking did he? hack. Yeah, you just oh, said it makes God. Me Can you go back to stand up for a month just to get your shit back together? Listen, nothing? All right, cool. Um, I thought you were still doing stand up. Is that too real? Um, yeah, there's a brain pill called. Um, uh, what's it called? New- Alpha Brain? No. <laughs> Alpha Brain, bro. <laughs> you Fuck those- those website? Fuck those beta brains. Not, not a, it's not a vitamin, it's an actual pill. It's not a vitamin. On it's Alpha Brain, pill. you don't need to do math. You just yeah. break the pencil. You just go, pencils are for fags. <laughs> snack. Gee, one good. plus one equals two. It's not a one supplement. plus one equals snack. It's an actual snack. medical pill. It's, Dicks it's going pussies. <laughs> alpha Brain. Stop scrolling so much. <laughs> I'm an alpha genius. Uh, alpha genius. I do my thinking by push-ups. Two in the pink, one in the stink. That's the only right. math I do. Alpha brain. <laughs> Alpha algebra. <laughs> <laughs> Two in the pussy, one in the stink. <laughs> we are having a lot of fun here. Me yeah, and Lewis Bobby's, are. I know what he's doing. He's actually looking for a real fact right now. Gabby's just checking her social media. I just, I, I have such it's uh, my brain. Life. I have such fucking. Now it's now Why are you singing that? I have such um, fucking 
I can't, I, when it's like when somebody's driving, I get fucked up. When somebody's on the computer and they're typing in the wrong things, I want to fucking smash the keyboard. Yeah, mm-hmm. you almost killed yeah. Kelly Fastuka multiple times for doing that wrong. <laughs> Um, fuck, I forget the name of it. All right, well, call gotta, Dr. Steve or take the if brain you were pill. Taking, <laughs> yeah, you I'm gotta take the taking pill. It. Type in brain drug. I mean, that it does nothing on Google. Drugs. You might as well type in type boobs. in brain drugs. But all drugs are related to the brain. No. Yeah. I mean, they gotta go Tylenol the brain. is a yeah, brain you drug. You dumb, dumb. Smart. The fifteen top sorts of fucking fifteen things, right? There. Oh man, you really are All like right. if a gorilla could yes. talk. <laughs> You're just like, nah, nah. scroll down faster. Food. Those are Food. faster. Weather. Stop! 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 stop. What? Quartz? This how he talks to huggers. <laughs> <laughs> They're down, down, down fast, down, 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 down fast, You fucking dumb go, go, fat go, go, idiot. Go, 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 he talks to huggers the same way he talks to one of those claws and pick up the stuff the animal. Left, right, uh, fucking drop the claw. Uh, Dad, I paid you Dad. 25 cents. Dad. Creatine? Dude, creatine. No, it's, it's not jacked. creatine. Is it hyperzine? Is it el- no. the prepazole? <laughs> <laughs> Is it methylbalite? Is it Ritalin? Ritalin? No, it's not Ritalin. Is it Provigil? What is the drug you're trying to say What's the one you're on right now? What's the one you're None taking? None of your fucking business. Oh, What's it called? None of your beeswax. What's it called? I see what you did. Dexedrin. What's it called? What is it called? Dexedrin. Dexedrin. Dude, this kid nah, I went to college with. No, no He's going to ask me three times. I just wanted to get it out of him. That was a good call. Dexedrin. But they're also, uh, Dexedrin <laughs> is what my buddy in college used to take. And it's like, it's basically Adderall, right? It's like a lower it's version. With, of, yeah, without the speediness. So yes. I'm not as hyped up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, thank God. You know, some, that, I, I, I agree with you it's, on that uh, Talking to you, uh, there was a couple times where I was like, I got to go. Yeah. Because I was gonna, I was fucking anxious talking. There was to Lewis. one time where I was trying to spill my heart out to Lewis <laughs> at the stand, and he was so Adderalled up that he just didn't pay attention, and I was like, "That, that just hurts." <laughs> I was keyed in on my own life at that moment. <laughs> yeah. But then you're just on your phone, and I was like, "Hey, Lewis," and you like looked at me, and I was like, "Yeah, I'm kind of having a tough time going through this breakup," and you go, "Yeah." And he just went back to your phone, and I was like, oh, well, I guess I'll just well, sit you know, here and dude, I'm fucking thinking at a higher level. You're talking about some bitch you've been dating for six months. Ten. It was ten. Who cares? That's not real love. <laughs> you're hurt. such a dickhead. Your friend's reaching out for help, and doggy, you fucking shut you, up. You say doggy again, <laughs> I'm going to shit on your hand. If you're in a ten-month relationship, yes. yeah, that's not enough for me to care. What do you, you when do you up. care as a friend? Um, it has to be, you have to be like, it has to be real fucking love. All right. I say, I, mean, I don't know why years. you could judge that not in 10 months. Certainly felt real. Uh, Amy Schumer's know. married less than six months. Yep. Get out of town. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Is that how long she's yeah. known the guy less than six months? Yeah. And your best friend Dave just got engaged less year. than a year. No, they were a year and a half. All right. A year. <laughs> yeah. A year. Dickhead. You're under two years. Fucking dickhead. 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 Doggy year and a half. dickhead. Are you guys going to kiss now? No, we're going to fight oh. like we always do. Oh, how long have you and Kim been um, together? Uh, it'll be a year in May. Do you love her? Yeah. Well, there you go. Is that that real love? love. That's 10 months. No, no. No, two years. It's not real love? If I broke up with Kim and I was bitching about it, you should call me a faggot. Oh, really? Bitching about it's going for 10 months. Yeah, bitching about it's really going, hey, I'm having a, kind of having a tough time going through this breakup. Oh my God, you whiny faggot. Even now I'm I'm replaying it in my head right now. (laughs) And you're going back to your phone? (laughs) I love Lewis is literally one of five guys who can still say faggot. I like that Lewis and nobody paints, says anything. I like that Lewis paints himself into a corner <laughs> where he's got his own rules he's gonna have to live by now. If a breakup yeah. happens under two years, I'm like, I don't care. And he's yeah. like, I'm suicidal. I'm like, you're a pussy. You don't get you don't give a fuck about breaking up with girls though. You move on quick. No, what I do is I remind myself that time heals and that uh, <laughs> oh, I hate this. Throat? This new drug is the worst do you drug have a I've throw ever. Throw pillow? <laughs> What did you get? Yeah. A silky terrier? He goes, I, sh- I know that <laughs> behind every cloud the sun still shines. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that. I hate positive Lewis. If I have one foot in tomorrow uh, and one foot in yesterday, I'm pissing all over today, faggots. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, when I looked hey. down at the sand, there was only one set of footprints. <laughs> I then I realized Jesus was being a bitch and riding on my back. Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell where'd you, it wasn't a dude carrying me because I'm not a fag. <laughs> <laughs> hey, where's your ch- poster? Where'd the chubby guy go? <laughs> Anybody know? Oh, oh God. God. All right, great. I, I thought I thought he was a ghost. We're going to find Ava in the yeah. hallway hey. strangled. <laughs> yeah. Um, She's like, Why did you let him in? <laughs> Esty comes upstairs. He just killed half of the kitchen staff. Who was that man? <laughs> we told him there was no more shawarma yeah, here. It was next door. He ate his way through the door. That is We're, weird that he's not here. Right? I know. How do we? How do we not see him leave? He probably. Yeah. And why is that Lewis curtain a, open? And there's a backpack there. This is could there? be like a marathon. Oh, that'll be the best backpack. thing ever. That's mine. Survivor. That's mine. No. So um, I want to introduce the couch to what's your name? Shimon. Remember we talked about this at the beginning? The Shimon. Mic? 
Shimon. Yes. You name Shimon. Yes. Mm -hmm. Orthodox Jew. Okay. Oh, Mazel tov. wow. And who's the uh, <laughs> Arab next Hola. to you? <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm Stephen. Stephen what? M Mitchell. Okay, Stephen. <laughs> Stephen Mitchell. <laughs> Stephen, Stephen welcome, welcome he's to the, the show. show. He's the uh, linebackers coach for the Florida Gators. I was just going to say assistant oh, offensive oh, line coach. God. Oh, oh you, you guys promoted. are so Linebackers fucking... is more. Okay. I was going to say the water boy. Okay. That's fun, too. Uh, I was going to say, did you see the chubby guy leave? No. I just snuck out. Wow, maybe he's a ninja. Oh, dude. I, I love if that. I love if something we said offended him and he laughed. <laughs> he was like, I didn't want to hear that live. The, the, the too two, many N words. The three N's and the one yeah. the two the two F's. He goes, I don't oh, like I don't like Lewis's view on love. <laughs> <laughs> I've been in something for a year and it's true love. You got bummed out when B left. What? B was a, true love. They had a kid, right? And they were together for three years. And she I, didn't can, leave. He, can he I fucking talk her. for himself? I'm uh, standing fucking, up for him because he's hurt. All right, you're his assistant. Hi. I'm trying to talk can to my friend anything? about his relationship. Can I get you anything? Uh, no. And um, <laughs> What the fuck? He's a fair boss. <laughs> Lewis is in fucking serious uh, CEO mode He's today. got He's got inside the actor's <laughs> yeah, studio yeah, vibe. Yeah, he's an actor today. He's not a comedian. Me and Bobby and uh, Rob Sprance and... and Ralph Sutton had a business meeting on the phone yesterday. It's a hilarious like meeting of the fucking minds. Then it just turns into like a pissing contest between me and Rob Sprantz. Sick of it. No, it's not. Yes, it was. What are you talking it's about? Exactly are you guys merging? Is there a merge? There's a merge. <gasps> no, no, no. Shh, don't talk about the merge. All right, <laughs> listen. Wait, no, no details. All right, listen. No details. But here's the deal. Time merges Lewis, all wounds. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I've heard that. <laughs> when Lewis, Lewis, <laughs> Lewis, when Lewis talks shit, he he has this fucking. It's like a motor that just goes, mm -hmm. and it's fuck it. You have it's to jump brain. in and say, blah 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 blah. You know what I mean? And we were talking about these things, and there's just certain things you have to lay down at a new relationship. All right, what about this? What about that? What about this? Yeah, yeah. Of course, of course, of course. That's pretty much the way it should go. Of course, of course, of course. Absolutely, yes, of course. But you have to say it because if you don't say it, and then something happens, is like, well, you guys didn't say anything. Well, I thought you just assumed it, so it was just that. So Rob said something, and Lewis was like, why would we do that to you? Why would you? And it was like, no, Lewis. And I was like, Rob, I was the only way that would happen is if we are thieves. <laughs> <laughs> like, but we've you... we've been we've been robbed. Right, I understand. We've that. been robbed. 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 Yes. Ah, come on. We've been robbed. We've been robbed. That's just to be the name of your uh, reality show. Oh, you guys Ooh. come in and you guys redo somebody's house. Oh, <laughs> and then we steal all the shit out. <laughs> yeah, you take it from the other room. <laughs> and then you didn't fix. you yeah. rape the teenage daughter in yeah. the bedroom. And then oh, you come right. in and do your show where you put in a security system because you're the one who stole all the shit because you're Puerto Rican. Yeah, you've been Lewis. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. And then show. and then we have a Joe Lisp version of it. Yeah, you've been listed. And yeah. that's where you sell <laughs> your sell house after it's all done. <laughs> oh. I give them all herpes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about mine? Part? You're not you're not in it. Yeah, you're on billions. Yeah, Sorry, you have a gig. Season three starts March twenty fifth. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. Yeah. I'm such a fan of the show. Never watched it. I know. <laughs> well, that's your loss. No. I you know I just don't have time to watch T V shows like that. So Yeah, I know. Yeah, you got fucking all this stuff going on. You're locked in. You're locked in. Oh, oh thank God. Where did you go? You really spooked us. He fell off a wall and it had to be put together by the King's Man. I mean, you <laughs> almost had it. God damn it, you almost had it. I was cheering for you. I'm not going to lie, when I first heard it, I was like, all right, uh, Lewis. Give him the bandana. That was a yes, nice hot thank one. Thank you. Oh, I mean, <laughs> that was a fucking tongue twister and a half. That was a flat tire. That wasn't Maybe a bandana. That was a flat tire. Uh, that was a. Uh, it, well, we did, it, it, that, that was a flat tire. What? That was a flat tire. <laughs> that was a flat tire. <laughs> That's all for you. Look at you panicking. I am king. Um, yeah, Rob yesterday, it was just a, I mean, I don't think he was d a dick thing at what all. What was the phone call about? He beat Lewis the way you have, you have to know this about you. When you start talking. It's so, scary. You, it's scary. Yeah. It's yeah. fucking it scary. Legitimately it is. your brain is fucking working. It's like, it's like on Adderall or whatever the fuck it is. That's true. You're fucking going to do it. This is the way. What we want to do is we represent the thing. And you're going like, and we like, you're listening and all of a sudden it's 10 minutes goes by and you're like, I got to say something. I said something to you yesterday, busting your balls about it, trying to fucking... Diffuse. Like, diffuse, thank you. Good, good assist. Dude. And you were like, this That's not really what we're going to do. Blah, blah, blah. You don't even need that drug. You could have Joe Lish just sit next to you, oh. and he could just tell you all the things that you want to say that would be smart. Yeah. Oh, the brain drug. You? Yeah. What, but uh, Yeah, but if Call I did it. that, it would be... Uh, Joe Lish is definitely cheaper than the brain drug. Oh, shit. I think I just shit my pants. Ew. Oh, that's okay. No, I didn't. I didn't. It's another dry <laughs> one. Another one. I'm came trying to help. Head. That's all right. You have those gin <laughs> Thanks, and Joe. That's good. Thanks, Joe. That's I good feel for like, you. I feel like your seat's going to be all slippery when wet. <laughs> Whoa! 
living on a prayer. Take my hand. Keep referencing we'll something that nobody else heard. Oh, oh, living on a prayer. Living on a prayer. Hey, how come I never heard that? Bobby, 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 Bobby. Oh, there you go. What was that right there? Oh, that's a great sweatshirt. I own Merch pump right there. Bobby doesn't fit in his socks. Joe's on fire. Joe's on fire. Joe's on fire. That might have been. Appreciate it, guys. Shit. <laughs> um, oh, shit, yeah, that YKWD sweatshirt, super comfortable. It Don't forget so the truth nice. shirts. There's truth shirts. I on need. There. I need a truth shirt and a Skanks hoodie. They're yeah. 25 bucks. Is that how you think that you Someone's order shirts? You just no. walk up to me and yeah. say, <laughs> it's not, it's, it hasn't worked in the past. I'm hoping it works now. What the fuck's wrong with you? What, of course, I mean, it's just, what are you going to fucking just say? Just fucking go to the website. He's your shoot friend. Me, shoot me an email. Okay. And I'll, I'll make it all come to your house. Okay. You just say, yeah, I got you, buddy. Yeah, merch pump. You get every. We're gonna fucking, I want a we're Tuesday. We're going to fucking attack him like that for I didn't attack him. You yeah, did. you did. He, 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 ex- he Lewis explained. He went, what do you think? I talked to me. I just That's fucking, Lewis explaining stuff. Just say, dude, I got you, pal. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's all right. Thank you, Lewis. The fuck, dude? The truth should be. Really be in the you know what dude section. Also, go to the. Uh, can you go to the realize podcast? Because yeah. I want a Puerto Rican rattlesnake shirt. Yeah, I right want... there on the side, right Where? there, Mike on the right, all the way to no, the right. Oh, yeah. There's a drop down He's as well. It. Yeah, look at that. Go might. I might get a go might. I want the fucking skank. Someone Red stole my nice. YKWD hoodie and my Skanks hoodie. The that person's going to go they down in a blaze of glory. All right. The suspect is an XXL. <laughs> that was the last oh one. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I want a red Gomite shirt. <laughs> oh, yeah. Can you get it in red? Can we do a wish list? Oh, yeah. Let's put together a wish list. Yes. Yeah, Let's, I want a Gomite. Because I want a Tim Dillon one. I, I, want, I want a Tuesday. I, I want a, a Gomite hoodie, but I want the Gomite on the back. I want, I want a John Bon Jovi t-shirt. Why do you keep saying John Bon Jovi? I don't, I'm saying a Bo- John Bon Jovi mood. No, you're not. It's yes, a I reference am. to something, and I'm Gabby is walking up. Bon <laughs> Jovi mood. Gabby wants to kill you right now, and I want to find out what the reference Why? is. Why? Is she getting hot and heavy? I don't know. Sometimes that's what happens when girls get horny, they get all angry. What do you call him? What do you call him? <laughs> what do you call him? <laughs> Gross? Yeah, I, I like Dexatrin Lewis more than I like <laughs> I, I think so. Dexatrin, you the fat loss yeah, I don't know what you're on. I thought that's what it was. You <laughs> seemed a little. Oh shit! Did you hear that? Yeah. Are you shitting your pants? That was something. Can you stop yeah. shitting your pants? Yeah. That was, Do you need something? Oh, that, that was a little thought for a chair. big man. Can real I ass get podcast you snake T-shirt. <laughs> um, I think I pooped my pants. Too. <laughs> like legit? Like when I pooped my pants at your house? No. Did you shit your pants at my house? Oh yeah, full underwear. When? Full. When I was dog sitting. I told you the story probably <sighs> ten times. Happy poopy. Is that, when you, is that when you fucked a middle-aged woman at my house? She wasn't Happy middle-aged at all. She was my ex-girlfriend. How old was she? She was, I believe at the time, 24 years old. Mm. I thought Gross. she was middle-aged. No. <laughs> it's middle <laughs> No, it wasn't oh, middle-aged. I thought, didn't you fuck an old lady at my house, too? No. Where'd you fuck the old lady? I don't know. Didn't you used to have sex with... He oh, fucked you know somebody that in was? your shower. He fucked somebody in your shower. Yeah, yeah. who'd you fuck in my shower? The older woman. Yeah, you fucked an old lady in my shower. Who's going to lie to you? Yeah. How old? She, was, she wasn't old. She was like 35. 35? My well, wife is our double that. What? <laughs> but this is when I was 25. Oh. Ooh, girl. Go like, get it, girl. Thanks, <laughs> thanks girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Throwing shade. <laughs> I had a guy place? offer to blow me in Key West. Hey, how much? Yeah, free. Free of charge. He offered Sarah. He said, hey, if Sarah, if you don't feel like blowing Joe tonight, which I like the idea that she just blows me every night. He said, I'm, I'm happy to do it. His name is Pony. There's Pony? <laughs> yeah. How did you turn that down? Yeah, he's a good looking guy. Get a blowjob from like an a outsider. Hot, hot guy. Handsome guy. White Was he shirt. a native? What do you mean? From there. American? An Indian. From there. For I want to take your snake, Joe, <laughs> into my mouth cave <laughs> <laughs> and pull the spirits deep into my stomach. <laughs> For I want to live off your essence. <laughs> As soon as you said native, I got so excited because I knew it was coming. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, he's like a Key West guy. Really? Yeah. Those people he was a are sexy weird. man, too. Really? What, like, how sexy? He was kind of like distinguished gray, like kind of white hair, older. Ooh, they, they, like call those, they call those silver foxes. He yeah. was a silver fox, yeah. Wait, really? wait a minute, like Richie Sambora sexy? <laughs> <laughs> Stop with the Bon Jovi what? references. I want to know references. what this is. <laughs> I'm making bon Jovi references. Yeah. 
I just love listening. My life. FN, it's now or never. Yeah, that song sucks. Every no, the song, one that sucks. The one that sucks. The one that sucks the most is Who Says You Can't Go Home? <laughs> How about this one? She's a little runaway. That's great. That's great early, song. Bon Jovi. Great song. Great song. My favorite well, one is Never Say Goodbye. That's a good one. What Not my favorite. Uh, you know which one I like? I'll never Say Goodbye. You know which one? My daughter works on YKWD. Is you that not them? Piece of shit, is that dude. them? You're a, you know what? What? Oh, I get it. What? Really? What? No shit. Good uh, for you. I it got pulled because of his shirt, right? No, not because of his shirt. I don't know why. I have to did actually, like, did your shirt? It was yeah, Bon Jovi. He hit the kill dude, button. It's his shirt. <laughs> why? Yes, stupid it's fuck. A, it's a bo- call me stupid fuck again. I'm gonna do throw it. a fucking. Oh do it, yeah, this is old one. KWD. Ready, Joe, let's down seven beers. What? We're still recording, so we can either pull and try to go back up live. Or just I'll put a different shirt on. I just need a different shirt. I don't think it's your shirt. It, what is it's it? It's got to be a shirt because one of the fucking assholes. These why get us off live? Just record. Fuck them live. Okay, uh, I'm taking live out. Live no. Because you fu- no. Because these silly. You know what you can do? You can start there, streaming. Why can't it be on Gas Digital? Not even be on the fu- network. These fucking assholes. Mm. Watch it. Just to fucking. If you say the n word, they'll fucking report it, and they, and they fucking turn. They take can't it down. report it for yes, saying the n word. Yes, they can. Wait, really? Yes. Off what? What's what? I say the n word weekly on Legion of Skanks. Nobody watches that. I know 100,000 million people watch. Shut up, I'm kidding. Shut hey, up. man, I'm alive, taking each day and night That reminds me, Legion of Skanks will be live in Los Angeles the last week of March. I'm still on that, right, doggy? Feeling like doggy. a Monday, so but someday I'll done. be Saturday night. What? Uh. Still recording? Every, nothing stopped from recording, but we're not live. Yeah, because you said the N-word. That's not true. That's not true. So you can't. <laughs> it was because you said mean things about Blue Apron. Uh, you know what I bet it was? <laughs> and we I bet you my rendition of It's My Life was so accurate yes. that they were like, dude, yes. that's copywritten music. This has happened to and me before. And the algorithm popped it up. This happened to me on the bonfire when we sang Crash Test Dummies. Mm-mm-mm. It was too good, and they pulled it for copyright infringement. We're going down in a blaze of glory. Oh, I like that Shut one, too. down, yeah. down. Lord, I two. never drew first, but I drew first blood. I'm a young gun. Call me young gun. Joe's singing down, 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 Fuck, he goes to the top of her ass crack. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Got a little bone. What about Christian, little Christian up? Slater, yeah. right at the end of his, and that right at the when he jumped the shot. Now he's back. I don't yeah. remember that part. He is back in Mr. Robot. Second one's not as good. Ooh, love that show. No, the second one's better. That's Young ridiculous. Guns too. What are you doing, doggy? Why are you taking a picture of me? You want to get hey, fucked what up? What is going on? Want to get fucked up, doggy? Uh, I like that Lewis still fights through the pills to be Lewis. Want to get fucked up? Are you recording me? Um, are you I would love for this? you to fucking throw some Hey, slugs. Patty Garrett, that's what I used to call you. Can you please stop? All right. Well, I just wanted to let you know I could go deeper. I don't <laughs> think so. I don't think that's a B-side. I don't even know that song. I had to go into it's my on phone multiple times to figure out Bon Jovi references. I love Bon Jovi. <laughs> I, I listen to Bon Jovi constantly. Do you? Yeah. Fucking constantly. Love him. I wish, I wish we had some love sort of em. connect. Love him. To the band. I listen to it all the time. It? Bon Jovi. Them. One of my, my Max's favorite uh, song. Happy That's how bad Bon Jovi is. It's a four-year-old. A four-year-old identifies with the music. <laughs> you know what else he identifies with? Santa. Dum dum to cow dum dum cow. But in Max's defense, my favorite album at his age was Huey Lewis and the No, he's just calling you a doo doo cow. He goes doo doo cow. Doo doo cow. Get a doo doo cow shirt. Come on. Doo doo cow shirt. I gotta get a doo doo cow shirt. I love the doo doo cow. Doo doo cow. He's going da da doo doo cow. Doo doo cow. Da da doo doo cow. Doo doo cow was so good that Joe immediately went that pointed her. Write that down. Brown chicken doo doo cow. Ah, doo doo cow is my favorite new thing. Uh, doo doo cow. <laughs> doo doo cow. Are Sounds like a on? Chinese dish. Are we back on? You're back on live. Yeah. Back okay. on live? Oh shit! And every. every- <laughs> 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 you knew you were gonna do it. Hey, you were gonna do it. <laughs> oh, I, I really should have. Everybody. Really <laughs> And we're up, and we're gone. (laughs) (laughs) And it's back off. (laughs) Doo-doo cow. 
Do do <laughs> Joe, I'm sorry I came down so hard on your singing. That's okay. I Joe, like I loved a, it. I think I'm doing a good job, really. I, I mean, mean, I don't think you are, but I'm sorry I came down. On I think you, you so, I think I like it. I like it a lot. Hey, Patty nope. Garrett. Nope. That's what I used to call Too you. <laughs> Too Who's that? That's Bon Jovi, dog. What song? Deep Track. Yeah, I thought you guys knew the fucking biggest movie of all time. Which one was that's that? The biggest movie of all time. It's one of our favorite Young movies. Guns? Yeah, it's Young Guns 2 soundtrack. Also on it? Yes. Didn't Santa Fe? Songs? You listening to Santa Fe? Or is that just me? I thought it was just a type of taco. That's what? Wow. What? All right, can I give it when to When have you ever had a Santa Fe taco? You a Taco Bell, <laughs> idiot. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> can I just say how defensive you got? Those so are very quickly. defensive. Those guys, it's a fucking Taco Taco Bell, you moron. Uh, uh, Santa Fe Taco Bell, idiot. Taquera, Santa Fe. Tacos. Taco Kisses. Are you guys on the Patrice Benefit tonight? No. 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 I did it last year. You did it last year. Right. I don't, I don't believe in the cause. <laughs> <laughs> Were you friends with Patrice at all? I mean, I was friendly enough with him, yeah. I went to his house once. You did where? Whoa. Which one? For uh, Thanksgiving. I think it was Thanksgiving, one of the barbecues, something like that. It was oh, a barbecue? lot of food. A lot of food. Oh, what about Thanksgiving? Yeah, it was Thanksgiving. It sounds like you're lying because you're repeating. Yeah. That was good. It was a lot of food. A lot of food. A lot of people there. A lot of Dave Chappelle was there. Chris Rock was there. Couches. He had speakers at one point. Oh, uh, there was food. There was uh, yeah, some black drinks. people. There was a lot of black people. Yeah, yeah. Black people. He was, he was, he was, he was, mean. He was mean to a couple people, but nice to another couple other people. Yeah. Lewis doesn't care for the term black people. He has a he's <laughs> he just shortens it. Yeah, significantly to get us kicked off online stuff. They're not really people. Oh Jesus Christ. Hell. Were you Are you finding you friends Santa Fe tacos? Like, friends? No, I wasn't friends with them at all. Thing so far. Yeah. At all? You didn't know him at all? I just spent two barbecues at DePaulo's house with him. But I wasn't. we never had each other's number. One of my favorite... Patrice knew who Joe was because one of my favorite things ever were Joe, Norman, and Sam Marillo and I were walking into the cellar before we were all passed mm-hmm. there. And we walk in and Patrice is walking out and, he, and Patrice goes, hey, Patrice... Uh, Joe goes, hey, Patrice. He goes... Hey, Joe. And then just a second later, he goes, I don't want to meet your goofy friends. And we just kept walking by. <laughs> it was one of my funny. favorite things ever. I can't believe it's five years. Five years? That? Really? Five years. You think about it, too. Five years. 2011. Or 2012. Shit, no. My son might have been uh, reincarnated as Patrice. Is that what you're going to hope? How cool. Are you would putting that him be? in fedoras? You are putting him in fedoras. Yeah. It's crazy to think. He'd be 38. He didn't wear fedoras, you dumb dumb. What did he wear? What hat? He wore Top like hats? Jewish hats, like the, the Hasidic Jews hats. They're called yarmulkes. I don't think I no, ever saw him wearing one. Oh. Yeah. Like, you know, one of his hats, a couple of them were those, the, the big black ones. Cowboy hats. Top hats? No. That was his head, Top hats. Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Daddy had this big black thing. Dude, I think I he used like, to wear a gorilla mask. He didn't mask. wear that. Yeah, he had those. Yeah, yeah that's what? what that's not what he wore at all. Absolutely. No, he I have one. You fuck. Dude, he I know wear... it's right over there, and it's not that. Dude, he used to wear the same hat that we the guards outside hat. of. That's not. That's not a Hasidic Jew hat. Is that actually one of his hats? Though? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There he is, right there. There's Patrice. <laughs> this is the one. That's not a Hasidic that's a, Jew is hat. That a, is that a Patrice no. O'Neill worn hat? This is his hat. He's got a big head. Fuck. Yeah, he did. Size eight. Good. That for was him. his hat that was given to me. Um, that was his hat. Uh, his mom and um, Vaughn gave all his friends a hat. That's awesome. That's not a Hasidic Jew hat, though. That's just no. A that's fedora. one of his. Hats. No, that's like a black pimp hat. But every everybody who got a hat was like, dude, I got the one that he wore in his special. It's like, no, you don't. Yeah, you guys no all did that. that. No, <laughs> you guys all. Kept that, yeah. yeah, you guys all said the one where you go. I got this one where he got. Oh, that's really cool. He never wore that hat. No, he, this is his hat. No, he wore Vaughn it. just went to a hat store if and bought I, 15 <laughs> of them and went, this is Patrice's, just sprayed some of his cologne on it. There you go. Look at the phone. Wait, so it's been, wait, no, it's been seven years. <laughs> it's been seven years. Seven years, yeah. sorry. Seven, yeah, that yeah. makes more sense. It's what a shitty friend you are. <laughs> yeah, because I was going to say he died in 2011 or yeah, 2012. Do, he's been dead. He didn't accept it the first two years. <laughs> it only felt like five years. So yeah. <laughs> well, it's weird because then Keith had a stroke. Yeah. Which was fucking awful. And then Colin just had a heart attack. Ew. Yeah. So, I know, and everyone was praying for Voss, It's going to be so right? funny that... <laughs> yeah, it's going to be funny if he's the only one that made Voss makes it. Oh, Voss will be like, they're all gone. Yeah. All of them. I lose a couple they're of feet. They're all gone. Yeah. I lose feet. Norton gets AIDS, oh, finally. Dude, if you have fucking war... <laughs> if you have war vet legs where there's a little stubby... I got to roll in. You guys hate me because you got oh. to gotta pick me oh, up. Oh, shit. Lieutenant, Lieutenant Bob. Oh, God. I can't wait for Born on the 4th of <laughs> July. You should have just let me Bobby. die, dude. Dead. I go, I go, Bobby Kelly got new legs. <laughs> <laughs> Bobby, you got no legs. Uh, there's metal. <laughs> uh, I was just 
just, there's just Voss, a fit of, still got abs. Yeah, oh, yeah, he'll still be jacked when he's 70. He is pretty funny. Oh, oh yeah. call call's coming in. How cool would it be if it was Patrice? No. Oh, <laughs> like white noise with Michael oh, Keaton. Oh, my God, how cool would oh. it be? Shh. I, I, I shut, shut up. Shh. Shut up, dummy. Uh, Bobby, shut up. Nigga, shh, this podcast sucks. I just got taken off. Nobody. Who the fuck? It was a call from the other side. Who was it? Mm. Who was it? The devil. Don't say that, Gabby. Sorry. Don't invite the, the devil. Who the fuck is this? I, I still have his number. Want to call it? Patrice? Yeah. Hell yeah. I want to call Patrice's number. Yeah. Let's see what would happen. Here it is. You ready? I don't want to talk to you. I don't think friend. much is going to happen. Mm-hmm. What, what if something does happen? Like what? Someone picks it up and goes, hello, I'm at work. Hi. Hey, Patrice. The number you dialed is not a working number. Because he's dead. <laughs> that, they take it that I bet you really wish your friend was alive, don't you? The number you dialed is well, nope. He's still dead, Bobby. What do you think was going to happen? Patrice is going to pick up? <laughs> what if somebody answered and they're like, hello? And I was do you like, have a voicemail? Who's this? And they went, who's this? That's and I was like, Patrice, and he went. <laughs> and then he was like, get better at improv. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, ah, yeah, you need to know how to riff better. <laughs> <laughs> this is going nowhere. I uh, we should have Kevin Meany benefit, you know. What? Yeah, Kevin Meany's great. Yeah. Were you friends with him? I was friends with him. Yeah. Friendly. Oh, you, 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 well, do one. You just you, you're friends with him. Do it. Well, it's just. Uh, I mean, I'm not friends with him anymore. I don't. Do I have anybody that I'm really close with that died? Not even alive, really. Like that's a thing. <laughs> uh, <laughs> do you not laugh at anything that's mean to you, or are you just fucking stone? No, nah, you're right. I, I, yeah, I'm really bad at taking a hit. <laughs> <laughs> I like that this new drug's making Lewis very passive aggressive. He really stinks. I don't like it. He's really, he's, all, he's, he really e- is. he's like, emo Lewis now. He goes, yeah. Why would I when everyone just takes dumps on me? <laughs> he really fucking. It's hard for stinks. a cloud to. It's hard for a cloud to cry all the time because that's all clouds do is cry. <laughs> I'm always raining. <laughs> you like the Incredible Hulk? <laughs> I'm always getting shit on. <laughs> I usually let Dan run out of steam. I don't yeah. like it. He let me like, punch out. He rope a dope me. I don't like Lewis's new tech. I'm going like this. I'm going like this. Yeah. Yeah, fucking give up. Lewis it's like just, Rocky and Rocky yeah. 3. He's let him punch himself out. Like, Lewis just calmly man. waits you out until you fucking run What's out of steam. What's he doing? He's losing. Nah, he's getting angry. Like, <laughs> he's getting real ass. <laughs> Uh, uh, still there. Oh, he's there. <laughs> he's back. He's back. I think we. But lost then we him. lost another one. Yeah, but I don't know. No, I'd fuck say he's he more stomach. It probably was the Jew hat thing that pissed him off. Oh, right. that oh, guy's yeah. legit. Hey, orthodox. Did he he's leave? Legit. No, he's in the bathroom. Oh, more like worth a dick. Crying. Ha! <laughs> you got it. Um, save it to him when he gets back. Yeah, save it, bud. Save I that guess it's seven seconds. years, but how long is the? Is, this is the fifth annual, or is it the f- sixth annual? Yeah. I think it's the sixth of, annual because last year was the fifth annual. Okay, sixth annual. Yeah. Took a couple of years to run out of money, then they had to fire up the benefit. Yeah. Are um, you on it? Uh, tonight I am. Yeah. You Who are else is on it. I took a couple of years off because I just felt like other people. There's other people that were friends with Patrice that wanted to do it. And uh, I didn't want, you know, all right, so here's the lineup. Go back. What's the lineup? Let's see. Uh, oh, Brendan yeah. Burns, Bill Burr, his Pete, good friend Sam J, Pete Corielli, yeah. Sam J, Jessica Who's Sam Kirsten. Jay? She's a comic writer on. Um, She's very funny. SNL. Uh, Cypher Sounds, Rich Voss, Jim Norton, Jessica Kirsten. Rich hosts every year, so he's yeah. on it every year. Norton's on it every year. Uh, Colin would have been on it. Maybe he can call in. Bill Burr puts it on with Maureen. That's pretty good. Doggy. Mm. That was fucking solid. That was pretty solid. Uh, maybe you can call in. Call in. Call, call in. in. I got it. I don't <laughs> think you did. Absolutely. I got it the first fucking time. Call in. That's Sam J. Oh, yeah. I met her the other night walking down the street. Uh, you sure? I, yeah, yeah, I swear to God. You sure it was her? I, she walked up to me. Do you think all black people are the same? <laughs> no. Do you think that's the truth? No, no. Mike is losing his shit over there. Mike, you all right? What's what? happening, Mike? What? We have to do the read. Oh, oh shit! Yeah, yeah. Mike, you, he was, you let us flow. He was giving Gabby bedroom eyes. No. no, Mike, thank you, Mike. Mike's a good producer. He's got to fucking get these in. Where'd you go? You go take a pee pee. All right. Um, they have that. They have sort of like an "I'll be there for you" type of energy between them. <laughs> I'll be there for you. These five words I swear to you. When you breathe, I wanna be there for you. I'll be there for you. I'll live in a dive for you. I'll be there in the sky. I'll 
for you. I got it. Words can say what, what love, love can do. do. I'll be there for you. Legitimate. I legitimately thought you guys were going to do the theme song for Friends. Yeah. I apologize. <laughs> Deepdiscount.com. Lewis knows bad. all about Doggy, this. I love Deepdiscount.com is a loyal sponsor to my show and a great site to save money on all your favorite shows. There's just a few more days left in February to save an additional 15% when you enter code YKWD15 at checkout. That's 15% off all your orders of TV shows, movies, and music too. At deepdiscount.com, you'll save on award-winning films, too, like Goodfellas, love that movie, The Hateful Eight, The Green Mile, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, and The Grand Budapest Hotel, and so many more. So go see for yourself. And be sure to use my code, YKWD15, during the month of February to save 15% off all your favorite titles. Stop searching, buy it, and watch it when you want. You'll find new releases, too, this week. Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri, starring Woody Harrelson. He's a sheriff. And Frances McDormand, she challenges his ability to solve the brutal murder, murder of her daughter. This movie is full of bizarre, unexpected turns. It's kind of like a dark comedy thriller. Get your copy for a great price at deepdiscount.com. Be good to yourself. Buy your favorites. Support my sponsor. You're supporting the show. Click the Deep Discount logo on my homepage, riotcast.com slash Robert Kelly. This way, they'll know I sent you. If you use that, that link right there. Be sure to enter the code YKW15 all through February for an extra savings. You get 15% off on all your music and video purchases. Watch it when you want. Check it out now. Deepdiscount.com. Thank you, Deep Discount. Oh, shit. So there was a mass shooting again. Oh, come on, oh, Bob. God. We're trying to have fun. <laughs> Wait, did they? No, Good time, in dog. Come being, being an asshole. Do you know that you can go in Florida at 18 and buy a handgun or an assault rifle? Yeah, you can do, that, that, Arizona. You can do that in Arizona, too. With nothing. In Arizona, yeah. you can walk into a gun show and just fucking walk out with a gun. At 18? Yeah. You can just walk in. My dumb roommate, buy... my roommate went in to a gun show in Arizona and legitimately... It, it, by the way, this is in my This Is Not Happening story, which comes out today on uh, tomorrow on YouTube. But he walked in. Oh, you still a, did the show? I rocked an Ari shirt. I actually talked to Ari about it, about doing the show. Weird. Uh, is it weird? Because I told Ari I wanted to bail, and then he asked me not to because it would fuck over the crew. So, I didn't. He, I'm pretty much a I good asked, I, uh, He actually <laughs> told me to bail, and I did. Yeah. That's impossible because I know he didn't tell people to bail. No, he didn't tell people to bail, but everyone that was his real friend bailed. I bailed. You bailed? I, I bailed. Oh, so Big J's not his friend either? I didn't do it bailed. this season. Big J did it this season. He had them pull it. I swear to God. He didn't have them pull it. I swear to God, Big J had them pull I it. I have the lineup and what is coming bet? out. I, his episode's coming out in two weeks. Dude, I'm telling you right now, look it up. He we had talked him, about it on Genesis. He had him pull it. He had him pull it. It was a whole thing. Are you, are you kidding? Big Why did Ari tell me to do it then? I don't know. I you... filmed it in an Ari Shafir shirt. Yeah, you did it. I hate all it of it. It feels like you're mocking Ari in the shirt. Yeah, yeah I go yeah. I go like this. Or, mm. <laughs> 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 I go, boo, I want a black host. Mm. It's understandable. I mean, you don't have a lot going on in your career, yeah. so you got to take any opportunity. Yeah, yeah. Listen, I'm willing to step on my friend's throats to get to the top. We Lewis, know. you're next. We Move. know. Oh, really? Bobby? <laughs> go fuck yourself. Um... <clears throat> I yeah I didn't do it. I couldn't. I didn't want to do it. But I, I called. Couldn't, I couldn't do it because I had a uh, there was a movie a heart? thing. <laughs> <laughs> I like. I like, I like this new drug. I really movie. don't like. I, re- I like it. What? I fucking hate you. I what? called Why Ari and talked to him, and you're asking like I'm a. Well, you're like- really solidifying the fact that you're a terrible friend. <laughs> <laughs> I love the new- shitty to Ari. I love you the hate new me? Lewis. I hate what. Me? Goddamn right I do. <laughs> Just fucking solidifying that. I already said he's over it, if it means anything. You can't Thanks. stop looking at Lewis's shirt, too. It's fucking, yeah. I just want to suck your tits right now. Just kiss me. Those are such good titties. I love the yeah. nipples. Um, those are perfect tits. Perfect yeah. tits. Um, One's underneath Lewis, our bed, either. Yeah, I was going to say, Lewis, you have perfect tits. I do have perfect tits. I didn't do it, but I couldn't do it. I, I was, I was going to have to switch it around, and, and it just worked out that I, I was like, dude, I have this thing I have to do, so it works out for me. Yeah. So I didn't do it. It is bizarre. Seeing I had the, something uh, else I, had, I booked mm-hmm. that I, it was going to be too hard to well, do. Well, I called Ari, and I was like, hey, I don't want to do this if you're not hosting it. And he's like, I appreciate that. He's like, "But because Ra- like, Ralphie May bailed, a couple other people bailed. Yeah. And I was like, well, do you want me to bail? And he's like, at this point, you're just fuck over the crew, and he's like, are, are and you, he's like, that's why, I, that's why the show. But who's the season. producer though? I think who's Ralphie the guy? Had a better was, excuse than you though. It was yeah, Ralphie. Who's died. the producer I have an excuse, guy? So well, I'm sorry, well, I have a question. Would you say you love Ari? Your yeah, friend? you yeah, love yeah. him. Love him, death. 
Well, with that attitude, I think you give love a bad name. You give love. Can I tell you this? Out of all your Bon Jovi references, I was the most excited for that one and the most disappointed. That one was really great, I thought. I liked I, it. I felt bad because I'm not good at mustering up like a fake laugh. I was hoping someone else would do it, but it was <laughs> funny. I mean, technically, that should be a bomb, Dana. There was zero response. It. I have it. But he already caught one for the flat tire, so but, we'll, yeah. Yeah. we'll call it even. That was like a bomb, it's, but a really great bomb. But Ari, Ari was like, yeah, you're going to... We know. Eric we, Abrams, we, yeah, we his you. executive producer, was like, he's going to fuck over Eric, and I don't want you to do that to Well, me. I talked to Eric. I felt bad. That's I almost did it because I felt bad for Eric. I like Eric a lot. Yeah, I like Eric, too. But it was just... And he's not think, the one that fired Eric's Ari. A cuck. You think Ooh. Eric's a cuck? Yeah. This is... Lewis just wants to say cuck, but then also doesn't realize that he could... God, I hope I like Eric Abrams is a, I like the word a fan of this show and also has to book Lewis on. Yeah, he's goes, not. He's not listening. His wife's getting fucked right now. <laughs> he's watching it. Oh my god! Well, that's what a cuck does. What do you? Yeah. You don't like the guy? <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't know who he is. Oh, <laughs> his wife is Ari's manager. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. yeah. Oh weird. Yeah. 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 So highlight this part. Market. Yeah. Put this out on yeah, Instagram. This is the one we would have put out on Instagram. <laughs> but also, Ari just, just make managers. sure I wasn't just being booked Lewis. on the show anyway. Don't worry. What? Oh, so you didn't give up on the show. So you were lying to make me feel bad. Oh, you believed all of this? Yeah. You're a fag. <laughs> I am. Uh, you're really, it was just it. like, I, I knew he didn't really believe it, but a part of him really did. Yeah, there was a part of me that really believed it. I was I like, God damn it, my bad friend. I didn't really do it because of that. Well, you had something else. You had well, I was a No, you just friend. admitted it, that you would pick another gig over Ari's. Show no, not over. Sorry, show. Sorry, show. Sorry, show. He's still the executive producer. He was not. Yes, he is. It was not. Yeah, it was not. Oh, fuck it was. I'm getting all sweaty. I feel like my uh, take your tit. Well, your texture might be. Uh, uh, I got a. Uh, What's the drug again? Um, I got I a know. batch of bad medicine. Ah, there we go. I liked that one better because he <laughs> made one, eye contact with Gabby. But it was so telegraphed and he couldn't get it out. No, he got it out. No, I think it was good. It was Are good. you kidding? I like this part. He literally he his perked up out. in his chair and was like, oh, I, I got a... Uh, but he made eye contact with Gabby and that's And then that literally the podcast moved on. <laughs> I like and then he just said, bad medicine. I like that. No. That's bullshit. I think you retold it wrong. That one was horrible. Dan, it wasn't, you know... Moda, where... Modi... <laughs> What? Modifini. No, that's not Modafinil. it. No. Modafinil. That's what Dr. Steve texted us. Ask him the real name. The, oh, the, Dr. The, Steve the, said we can call him. It said Modafinil. Call, call, call Dr. Steve. Steve. Modafinil. Yeah. Call Dr. Steve. Modafinil. Provigil. Provigil, that's it. Provigil. Modifinil. We Provigil. said Provigil before. Yeah, we did, and you, you didn't say asshole. anything. asshole. Lewis I'm not it. on it, though. That's White Provigil. <laughs> if I was on it, then I would have known it. Can I have another brevet latte? Is a a a oh, Lewis, you bad girl. <laughs> uh, uh, brevet fucking queer. Um, yeah, Provigil. It's a brain drug, and it makes you smarter. And it's better than Adderall because it doesn't make you like that. Eat pussy? Yeah. Well, <laughs> 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 Do an impression of a turkey? Yeah. Why would you wow. ruin this? Wow. Oh, my Yikes. God. You tied around your neck and Yeesh. kill yourself? Jesus Whoa. Christ. Yeah, you should yeah. do it. You should do it. <laughs> Is this a bunch of those noises for the rest of the podcast? <laughs> you should do an impression of a turkey yeah. on Thanksgiving. Go in the oven. Schindler's List. Thanks, Dan. Wow. Why did you say Dan? Joe. It's Joe. Joe's going to be like, Keep wow, that was a good one. No, I don't. It was terrible. I mean, it was a purposefully bad one. See? He, so he, I will yeah. say that. <laughs> But I tell you, I like the bomb Dana. I like to call it a bomb Dana, not the bomb bandana like you've been doing for eight years, you Me? fucking dumb dumb. It's been seven years. Whatever. You don't even know how long ago your friend died. <laughs> I, was <waiting> <laughs> I was waiting for you to say that. <laughs> What's going on with the Bon Jovi? What happened with Bon Jovi? Yeah, why is... <sighs> You're, have you guys not talked about this? Piece of shit. Why you am really I a piece of shit? You're, we, we the fucking, you, you, you're, you're the TMZ of comedy. Oh, what that's fun, though. <laughs> what a cool new title. Like you're that's a real-ass really dude. It's really dope. You're the... Uh, Thanks, Duke, Duke, Duke. Can I just give you a new nickname? No, it goes, Duke, 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 real-ass dude. If to the TMZ, get the TMZ noise so we can do it with Lewis's. Real-ass dude. I don't want to give TMZ hits. Okay. Why? You don't like TMZ? They're horrible. Why? What are you talking about? There's celeb gossip horseshit. It's, it's the, the worst same part shit, of our doggy. Society. It's a whole fucking. Oh, what doggy? Will you stop with the I'm, fucking I'm doggy, doggy, you Long Island Can I tell you this? California love dummy? It. I love Lewis's use of, course of you doggy. Do. Of course you <laughs> do. I think it's great. Because if I say I hate it, you'll love it. I know no, that's not. I know how you work, Dan. No, it's not that. That's that not how you when you stop say Stop doing Bill this. Burr, okay? Relax. Yeah, <laughs> fucking come to Patrice Benefit, then. Listen, doggy. <laughs> good time, good timing on that sound effect, yeah, Mike. Great, great no, stuff. I didn't want it to. Uh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Mike's acting like his dad's a rock star. Come on, let's go. 
Wait, oh. is that true? I don't even yeah. know if this works yet, man. Is well, your dad uh, Bon Jovi? No. no. Yes, he is. Stop it. Her oh, dad, wow. his, her dad's Bon Jovi. It's not the right one. All right, get another one. Do another one. Wow, that's exciting. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> <laughs> your dad's not Bon Jovi. No, he's the keyboardist. Okay. Was he in the band in the 80s? Yeah. Wow. Is he still in the band? Is, that, is this Did how you doing it? Did he meet your mom backstage? Is this how you doing it? He's in the Hall of Fame. This is how you doing it. What do you want me to do it? I don't a know. A big reveal. Naked. It was never Naked. supposed to come up. Just, why would you, why would you, why would you let him break you like that? I mean, it wasn't really why a break. I mean, it's Lewis been the whole. It's better than the way that it's I want to break her. <laughs> what? It's fine. What? Sure. <laughs> 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 I like Bobby. Bobby's salacious to you. Better than the way I want to break her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a salacious turn. That is your best impression. That's the fucking cowardly lion. <laughs> Put him up. Put him up. Put him up. <laughs> Did you get it yet? Holy uh, shit. Mike. Yeah, Mike, Mike. What's up, dude? Get the fucking sound effect. It's Holy over. It's way over. Shit. I don't even want to do this anymore. I don't even want to do this podcast anymore. <laughs> ever, I don't even want to. YouTube's ever, TMZ. Ever. That's not it. There's yeah, a boom that's sound not, effect. That's yeah. a boom, it's supposed to be it says boom, boom, boom. It doesn't even say TMZ. It says just boom, boom sound boom, effect. Yeah, just, just type boom, in boom, TMZ. Boom. Just type yeah. in TMZ and then go to any clip and no, then it'll sound open effect. With it. No, no. It just right there. It'll just open with whatever. Watch. It just. There it is. That's all we need. <laughs> now isolate that's it. it. Isolate it. Started put it on the board. Uh, we got it in the future. Yeah, then you it goes. Can put it on Ready? The board. Mike, go. Real ass dude. Real ass dude. Real ass dude. Yeah, see? Wasn't even worth it. Oof. That's because you're a professional <laughs> broadcaster, though. You're Gabby, broadcaster. your dad was in Bon Jovi in the fucking 80s. How <laughs> crazy meet, is that? Did yeah. he meet your That's mom? That's why Gabby's so hot. Yeah, you're your a mom rock has, baby. Her mom has to be a smoke show. Was your mom, did, how did your parents meet? no high rock school. star. High, high school? school? Oh, she was in high school and he fucked her? What a monster. I love him. Wow. He what? Oh, he fucked her going to high school? <laughs> he was in high school, too. A though, real rock star. That's why is he a monster? Rock star. He's taking on those keys. He was the same age. Oh, he was also in high school. Yeah, you fucking creep. Oh, I thought he set his keyboard up outside of the high school. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all the girls like fucking <laughs> came out like rats. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> so they were high school sweethearts. <laughs> yeah. Did he stay loyal on the road? No, no way. Really? What? Of course not. Wait a minute. Stop. What? You're ratting your dad out? Oh, he did stay loyal. Oh, uh, how do you know he's really your dad then? No, fuck all that shit. Know. Fuck Bobby getting. Uh, for you, real though, he didn't stay loyal. He fucked Olivia no, Newton-John. Nothing? Right. I don't know. I I'm trying to get to the real that. story. I just I take that? I you stepped on my Olivia Newton John. Why are you stepping on the truth? I fucking had You're stepping on the truth! We'll never know if it's funny! No one about Olivia Newton-John! We'll never know if it's funny! Skip, skip. No, no way, Skip. No pass. I don't know if I could talk about this. So your dad worked too long on it. Slow down, everyone. Gabby, do not listen to me. Look at me. In, they, these in the Bon Jovi charismatic fuck chases are gonna make you Gabby, look say at me. something look at me. that you don't want to say. Look at Bobby, me. Bobby, Bobby, can you stop? Control yourself. Bobby, okay. stop. All Bobby, right? stop. Because I'm not deleting Bobby, this. Stop. And if you did, Bobby, stop being a cock block, you fucking Bobby, asshole. You're right, you're right, you're right. So, Bobby, Bobby, stop it. You're right. Stop it, Bobby. Very Hold Bobby, Bobby, Lewis, carefully. Take care of Bobby. Hold on real quick. Bobby, Bobby, look, look over here. Hey, Gabby. Hey, hey, how you doing? Distract. So uh, yeah. in the in the pussy draft of Bon Jovi, what, what number was your dad selecting backstage? Pass. Ooh, no, you can't. I have to. Bobby, you fucked it up. Now we can't get any info. <laughs> no, no, she's really dumb, Dan. Keep on going. Okay. So he, did, he didn't stay loyal. Like at all. Like how many times no, no, did, did he no, get no, caught? No. Did your mom catch him? Pass. No, you can't pass. I gotta pass. Did your mom catch him? I gotta pass. At what age did? <laughs> what, are your parents? Gabby, yeah. look at me. <laughs> Is it because of that? Huh? Listen to me. Gabby, you can talk about Who this. Who just called me dumb? She is dumb. I know. I'm That's... not dumb. Yeah, you are. No, I'm not. Look at me. You're fucking dumb. Yeah, you are. That's true. Yeah, Lewis yeah, is, no, is dumb. Lewis is dumb? Lewis well, is dumb. Yeah. Lewis is smart at two things. What? Fucking? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's a great That's sentence. Good. Lewis is smart <laughs> at <background>. fucking. <laughs> <laughs> he fucks smart. <laughs> well, no, no, no. We should move. To the bed. Fucking outside is illegal. <laughs> we'll move this indoors. <laughs> the more Gabby, you know. How much can you talk about? Why don't you want to talk about your dad being a I'm so Jovi? interested in your dad it. getting puss from Slow being down. a Dan, Dan, can I interview for a second? I'll tell you, I'm, uh, a, I'm the only one here who actually knows how to interview Bobby. people. I'm Why the only one say? who knows how to interview people. You're an I'm idiot. Professional a, uh, broadcaster on SiriusXM interviewing fighters weekly for two so, years straight. Yeah, that's true. hard to do. 
That's hard to do. It's true. What did you do for training? I do a lot. It's good. You know. No, that's not what I did. I actually had a bad win. Wait, hold on. Do you want to interview me as a fighter? I will. Eh? Uh, right. So, uh, so what do you think about this fight? Uh, uh, you know, I'm just real proud to come out of this camp. I'm feeling a lot better. So, Rick Shapiro? Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. Man, I don't know, man. Now, who's next for you right now, though? I, whoever they're going to put in the octagon with me, you know? I'm yeah. just looking for another fight from Dana. Yeah. Huh? Just hoping to get out there. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. Now, do you see, now you're in the top five now. How does that feel? It feels pretty good. You know, me and my team, we've put in a lot of work, yeah. and, you know, we're just ready for that to pay off. Yeah. <laughs> I'm waiting for this bit to pay off. <laughs> ah! Ah! Interview Gabby. <laughs> Gabby. Yeah. What did you have like a deal with your dad where he was like, "Hey, don't you know if you do the show, don't go on the podcast and talk about me." No. Okay, then why are we not? Because he talked to you in pure keyboard. How cool would that be? <laughs> 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 like, uh, I understand like, it. I'm like, Dad, you'll never understand me. Bring <laughs> that up. Wouldn't that be great <laughs> if he just brought that up? <laughs> Gabby, Gabby, oh, Gabby, look at me. Okay. Gabby, look yeah. at me. Listen. Don't go chasing waterfalls. <laughs> That's not what we're doing, Dan. We're not just naming any songs. Okay. Are you? Are you? <laughs> oh, does your God, dad God. mind that you talk about him? I. Uh, he doesn't or is it, give is a shit. That's you. my own. She hasn't talked to her dad in twenty years. Yeah, I don't know. Him. She's actually great for her and him. She has a really good family. Does Jay? She has a brother and her, the mom and the dad, and I. They're kind of cool. They're not like yeah, they're cool. Stiffs. Right? Are your mom and dad still together? No, my stepmom. Does JBJ let your dad solo? <laughs> That's pretty JBJ. cool. JBJ. Uncle Have JBJ? you met JBJ? Yeah. Oh, get of course out of town. you did. Oh, his hair is. Oh, can I nice smell and... your ass? Oh, why? Yes. What? Yeah, okay. Well, did you just say yes? Why is his ass touching <laughs> well, JBJ? Oh, no. I oh wait, what? What? <laughs> oh, wow. Know. Gabby went full go. You go, can I smell your ass? She goes, sure. And you're like, oh. Wait, Tell, him that, fucked up. No. <laughs> Tell him that <laughs> fucked up thing that he did to your father. No, no I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Oh, JBJ? I'm kidding. Did he do something? <gasps> what? Oh, oh, behind the music. I'm what did I say when we talked I'm about that? I'm kidding. kidding. There's no, what? <laughs> she's oh. lying. Who is she's the biggest? No, she's not. She's really mad. I, I swear to God, she's Gabby lying. Gabby is a terrible actress, if there's one thing I know about her. She's a great actress. You are really dogging on me today. Yeah. Oh, it's doggy. I like it. He's my language. It's called actor now. Female actor. Oh, that sucks. Gabby is a terrible stewardess. True, They're called plane cunts. Fucking idiot. Um, Gabby. Yeah. Yes. How come you? Are you? A, do you play music? Do you sing? A little bit. You do. Yeah. Let's hear. Can you tickle those keys. A little bit. Can Whoa, you play the you piano? Do you want to do it? Whoa, we're halfway there. Okay, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's her okay. cabin. That's a dead Mike, That's a Mike, with, Mike with accidentally great timing. <laughs> <laughs> he just got to it. <laughs> Sitting on it, wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh. well, so, well, but this is actually an interesting thing. Can you? Here's the. All right, you're not gonna. Obviously, you don't have to answer any questions you don't want to, but I think that's a fucking that how interesting thing. No, it, do, do you? You think that having a famous rock star's daughter on my show is in, no shit? Soon to be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Yeah. She's been here for a year, and this and is the first time she oh, up. Yeah, she's been here for six months. So that's not true love. Six? No, it's not true. Love. <laughs> Her uh, dad true love. is but like fictional. You in the also, show? She also asked, she uh, she asked, she asked. She didn't want to talk about it, so I said, "Okay, fine." She doesn't deal. care. She didn't yeah. care. Look at her. She's not like he's well, she JBJ. If it was JBJ, I'm like, I get it's it. It's been long enough that I could talk about it now. Right. It's been. It's up to you. One week. Well, well, don't do that. Now it's gonna be my head. Well, your dad, your dad is cool. Yeah, my dad doesn't care. That was my own. Right, and he's from Jersey. He was in the. Can we get him on the phone? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> How did he know JBJ? They uh, grew up call. together. They grew up together. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're so gonna call. Can, call can I, I know, I know, I know how they met. How? Hey, correct me if I'm wrong. Okay. JBJ uh, got a deal, a record deal. Needed a band. No. Can I finish my we're, story? We're talking about Jackie, Jackie, Jackie Bradley shit. Jr. By the way. Uh, let me John, see. John Bon John, Jones. John Bon Jovi <laughs> needed a band. He had a song. He had a, got a gig. <laughs> Got a gig at a place. He's in needed, Jersey. Needed a band. James Baldwin Knew Johnson. Her father, <laughs> right? They got together. Then they met uh, Richie at another gig. Saw them play. He was in Richie another Redding. band. And Tito was there too, <laughs> right? Tito? Tito Ortiz. Tito. Oh, awesome. T What's his name? The original, the bad boy from Tico, Huntington Tico, Beach. Tico. Yeah. Tico. Sorry. Huntington Beach bad boy. Yeah, and then they they did a they did a they were on a bus, <laughs> and then they were like, "Yo, I know you." And he was like, "I know you." And they were like, "Let's go down <laughs> this to the fucking the Asbury worst. Park." And he was like, let's go. This sounds like when a little kid is lying to his parents <laughs> about what happened. And he goes, and then they were on a bus, but the bus wasn't going anywhere. How did they meet? How did they meet? 
My dad's best friend is uh, John's cousin. Yeah. John, John, oh, you asshole. Look at her. What? <laughs> John. Mr. Jovi. John's cousin. We call him Mr. Bon Jovi. We call him JBJ. That's JBJ. The theme we're doing. Really I'm never going to do that. I'll never do that. Bon Jovi, but your dad, does anybody ever try to get to John through you? Yeah. Really? Yeah. She got really? Up what? Hmm? I am. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to talk to her dad about his sweet Casio skills. Yeah. <laughs> well, we have him on the phone, right? Yeah, he's yeah. right here. Yeah. Let's see. Hello, sir. Gabby's dad? That's interesting. No oh, shit. I didn't That's know that. Cool. Wow. I did not know Gabby, that. Gabby, were you always like that as a child? Yeah. It's good to know we both have herpes. That was really neat. <laughs> 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 He definitely has herpes, yeah. though, because, I mean, he's a rock star in the fucking I 80s. 80s? He probably has the hip. Yeah. I fucked him. 100%. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking hip! <laughs> Sorry. He's got banging you... without rubbers out there. There's... Well, how old are you? 23. So, what? here's the thing. You were, all right, what, how, what year were you born? Uh, it's not right. 50 sandwiches. Uh, it is the bandana. No, she so, laughed. She laughed. She laughed. <laughs> I'm laughing also. <laughs> it was funny. It was, I'm laughing because it doesn't even make sense. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. $250. $5 a sandwich. Oh, $5 a sandwich. Oh, okay. sandwich. Yeah. Lewis talks in sandwiches. No, he, he talks in sandwiches. You're That's sandwich. what I'm saying. I don't talk with the sandwiches. <laughs> Do you? You probably think that's We got to lose weight. Tomorrow we eat sandwiches. Um, um, so is your dad on tour right now? Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're $250 for shit seats. Shit seats. Did you ever go, uh, like, I've been times? twice. All right. I've been twice. Not talking to you. <laughs> Sorry. Through Gabby? No. Bobby, you're going to have to relinquish the spotlight for a few minutes. Yeah, let us Sorry, just relax. Guys, we're no, going to no, talk no, to Gabby no, for a no, minute, no, dude. No, we're we're going to... We're gonna do the regulars. It's gonna be our own podcast. You're not even invited. Yeah, we're gonna uh, we're gonna cut you out. It's gonna right. be a, it's gonna be like a right. spinoff right. show. All right, yeah. yeah, I'd love that. I'll stay home. Yeah, <laughs> uh, just make sure you do. Did the you ads. ever want to play the keyboard? I did music in high school, and then I realized I didn't want to do it. Okay. You can't play the yeah. keyboard. But now, you, is that a perm your father gets, or is that his real? No, it's real. Wow. Jufro. What? I what? See him. Kind of how old you, were you when you lost your virginity? Uh, eighteen. Nice. What the Woo! fuck is that? All right. Nice. Held off. Did it hurt? Shut What's up. wrong with you? <laughs> What's wrong with you? We're asking questions to Gabby right now. Uh, I love that Lewis, Lewis, relax. Lewis is back up. super medicinal. I've, back lo up. I've lost every girl on the show because of you. Back up. Bleeding. We're doing our thing right now. It's the regular. I need her. Yeah, well. All right. <laughs> so anyway. Questions. Anyway. How big was the guy? <laughs> Did you feel an inordinate amount of pressure? Were you in love or was just, you know what? I'm 18. Let me just get it over with. It was one of those. I Gabby, was. you don't have to answer any of these. Yes, she does. I didn't say anything. Okay. She said it with her eyes, though. Why don't you stay on She's fucking point with her? Keyboard. Stop talking about her virginity. Richie Sambora. Talk about her What's father. he like? Kind. Stay on point. Kind? Kind. Sambora? Mm -hmm. I did uh, not. Yeah. I've not heard that. I've heard he's a monster. I heard he's a racist. Yeah. My yeah. dad was the cello player for Deep Your Purple. Dad. <laughs> 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 Your dad was a fucking... <laughs> My dad played Triangle <laughs> for Slaughter. <laughs> <laughs> My dad played the oboe for uh, Toto. <laughs> oboe for Toto. Sure. Uh, oboe for Toto. So, so you, they're still like kind of fucking party animals, right? Yeah, that's okay. They're Are they really? They're not party Let animals. me. Ask, this just is a great my, question. I think just my dad. Your dad like still parties like it's in John's the eighties. John's pretty tame. Yeah. What about really? what about uh, what Stop about Tico? What about Tico? Sorry. Who's Tico? He's pretty old. He's the drummer. You fucking nut. No, Tico he's Torch. He's sober now. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
What's the coolest thing you've ever got to experience because your dad was in Bon Jovi? Great Not question. counting this podcast. <laughs> Great question. I got this by myself. Oh, wow. Yeah, I didn't even know she... I, I found out... You got a phone call from uh, four, John Bon Jovi? I, yeah. <laughs> I found out four weeks later she on her Instagram story, I saw her dad. I'm like... And then I, I was like, is your dad the fucking devil? And she's like, yeah. I was like... She put him on his, her Instagram story one time. That's how I found out. That's oh, how you fun. found out too, right? How'd you find out? How did I find out? People were talking about it on uh, the internet. Oh, the yeah. internet? Yeah, I think it was people were like saying something on Twitter or Reddit or... I forget exactly. What's but, Reddit? You know what Reddit is. Um, it's a website you go where you want to punch yourself I, in the face. What is yeah. reading it. Kill yourself. Yeah. It's all the same shit. It's just that uh, people are... You know, it's just another website with another... Thing to say mean shit. I, I think people don't realize that they're hurting our feelings. Oh, oh, they realize that. Our feelings. Oh, no, they realize that. Yeah. Why That's are you why hurt doing somebody? It? Why, do you, why are you? And I think they want to hurt you more now that you just said that. But why yeah. is he singing it? Why, why do they want to hurt us, <laughs> Father? Why do they say mean? Why things? am I singing it? Because you know who might be listening to you know what? That's a smart parentheses idea. Parentheses, dude, and I might be a backup singer. I can play tambourine. <laughs> Great special. <laughs> just kidding. So what is the coolest? Is there, thing? Yeah, there's a white kid I beat right it. Yeah, I'm good. I Take that down. No, no, I don't want to see wanna fucking. What's wrong with you? Just bad I don't things. I know what it was. I don't. I was joking. It was I a know what joke. Is. Day. It's a joke. Fuck a joke. Dude, are you joke. kidding me? Dad, I got you Reddit. You got your anger. Is that you know text from thing? him? Is he listening live and he's yeah. pissed? Oh, is man. that him? No. Oh. How fast can he text with those keyboard fingers? Oh. That's a whole paragraph. And a solo. Hey, hey, Dad. Oh, stop going. Stop yelling. Stop yelling. Oh, guys, my father's angry. I have to go in the other room. Uh, when she's hanging out with her friend, that's how he yells uh, He's been drinking. He says racial shit. Have you ever... Yeah. Have, what's the coolest he thing, didn't mean that the coolest all thing you've ever gotten from your dad's fame? Or experience. Yeah. Or experience. Experience. Uh, growing up on tour. You, so you went out on tour a lot. You were on, your, you were on a bus? Uh, no, on, on planes. Private, private planes. So you've been on private planes your whole life? Yeah. Whoa, Gabby. <laughs> Did John Bo did John Bon Jovi make you sit on his lap? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's what I would do. What's wrong with you? Well, that's what I would do. What's wrong with you? That's what I would do. What do you mean? <laughs> Lewis, Lewis spilled a, a bunch child? of food. I would make Gabby sit in my lap on my private plane. Just focus on cleaning. That. That's God, gonna fuck up the never camera. Happen. Oh, the camera's all fucked up. Oh, You're saying I'll never have a private plane? Yeah. I think you will, Lewis. Thanks, buddy. I think you have a real ass plane. I'm gonna be pretty rich, Gabby. Maybe you need to fucking get with the program. <laughs> I wish you'd do some private podcasts. <laughs> <laughs> it does. Talking. I like that Joe was so satisfied with that one. He went, yeah. Perfect. So Ooh. you've been on private planes your whole life? No, no, no. All right, Ric Flair. We get it. Oh, Limousine no. riding, Ooh. jet flying. Do you we fly, fly out later. Do you fly coach? I've flown coach. Oh, shit. Yeah, I don't I like the way you said that. No, I mean, Yucky. like, by myself, when I go places, I fl fly, fly coach. coach. Yeah. yeah. Do you do you, when well, you get on? Do you when you get on the plane? Do you go? I don't normally do this. My father's the this keyboardist. This is gross. This is so bon small. Jovi. What is? Gabby, uh -huh. you are a uh, Dan's dick. I thought Gabby, that was a thing about my mouth. Gabby, listen. <laughs> yeah. You are. I've never seen your stand up, but you're, you you guys are gonna roast battle each other. You and Mike, right? We're gonna be we in April. Whoa. 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 Gabby, and here's the thing: I've never seen her stand up. I'm I'm hoping she's funny because there's no reason for her to be. She's beautiful. She's fucking comes from a successful, rich family. There's no, there's nothing that uh, that has made you have nope. the personality type to go and do something like this. First and foremost, beautiful is a stretch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Muppet ass. Let's say attractive. <laughs> no, you're right. Yeah. Actually, if she didn't have that voice, she'd be really hot. Oh, what, the Muppet what voice? voice. Yeah, the Muppet voice. Well, how's she supposed to communicate with her dad without that voice? That is true. <laughs> she needs that voice. I don't think it's your voice. I think it's more the face. Not um, into it. No, I'm joking. All right. I'm joking. Of course you're beautiful. I feel That's terrible. what it is. Gabby's voice is she's half uh she's half keyboard. That joke is half finished. <laughs> <laughs> I like both of them. I like yours, Lewis. I know I was like bummed that you got it out by the time I it worked. It. I like both of them. Anyways, I'm just what's kidding. The, where's the most, what's the most uh, interesting yeah. place you've ever been or experienced? What is that? What's it because of your dad's success? Like, did you meet somebody? Africa, you went somewhere, somewhere fucking cool. You went to, you've seen some cool shit. You ever walk in on JBJ catching, he, getting a heege? No. Or a beege? No. A heege? Hand job or blow job? Hand job from a Jew? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to do this very quickly, John. Please finish <laughs> as fast as possible. <laughs> I need to go. Too much. Look at that. Huh? Look at that schwanz. <laughs> oh, that's a good piece. 
<laughs> oh, you're nice and snipped. Oi. I think it's a nice new character. Oi. I like. Hey, what? Oh, Jew giving a hand job? <laughs> gay Jew. Gay, gay, <laughs> gay Jew. Oi. Oi. And or Dracula. Yeah. I want to suck your dick. <laughs> the Jewish guy on the couch is just staring at the back yeah. of your head right now. <laughs> he goes, yeah, your career's it. done. <laughs> so Seven and a half inches. Uh, 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 uh. What? Uh, uh. Gay so you right. can't think of anything point. that's... I, I don't know. Come on. This guy yeah, you Who's the coolest person? Did Hold you meet on. a Beatle? Who's the coolest person uh, you've yeah, ever met? Wait, you oh, met Paul McCartney? Paul McCartney? I'm lead with that. You met Paul McCartney. Yeah, at, uh, at 12, 12, 12. Did you sit in his lap? Yeah. Who's, you sat in Paul's lap? No. Who's oh, the most uh, random uh, person uh, that you met that you never thought you would meet because your dad could tickle those sweet, sweet keys? Because <laughs> <laughs> he can play those elephant teeth. Yeah, I hung out with Paul McCartney also. No, you didn't. No, he does. He with Lu- yeah, yeah, he did. When? With Louis. Louis who? Louis C.K. Okay. Who's Trump. that? Famed comedian and masturbator. <laughs> <laughs> I call him the King of Jack. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you met Paul McCartney? Who, me? Uh, yes, you. Good my mother's there. texting. Me. <laughs> Serious. Is your mom uh, yeah, right? I spent. Yeah, she's great. Uh, yeah, I spent some time with him. Wow. He uh, made fun of me. Did you sit in his lap? What did he uh, say? No, when he put his hands on me, he was like, "You're not being funny right now. I'm just busting your balls." Is that what you really said to you? Yeah, something terrible like that. Terrible accent. Balls. Balls. Terrible. Yeah, I hung out with him. I met Bruce Springsteen too. Jesus Christ. Yeah, it was pretty great. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he's all bottom jaw. Cool. Yeah, yeah I don't really hey. care about meeting dudes because I'm an adult. Oh, uh, you only meet hot chicks that just want to fuck all yeah. the time. Alpha brain, nigga. Yeah. Oh, Jeez, Louis Jake Gomez. Uh, we just got cut. Yes. No, you didn't. Oh, oh dude, that would have been, been great. That would have been great. Mike has the comic fucking timing. I like Lewis as cool as Maxim Magazine cool. Yeah. I'm just going to read the transcript of this cars. voicemail. I did read Maxim Magazine like regularly for like that a was, long time. That was your literature? Yeah. yeah. It was pretty great. <laughs> I, went on, so I, went on a, is... I went on a Maxim tour to, to find the Maxim woman Ooh. for like six months. Did you all the way her? to the Super Bowl where they have the Maxim Super Bowl party, which was one of the Did biggest parties Did you name your son after this experience? Don't <laughs> <laughs> yeah, never forget Don, it. Tom goes, what do you want to call him? He goes, Maxim, Dad. <laughs> call him Maxim. What about FHM? <laughs> Does his middle name be FHM? <laughs> they, uh, oh, dude, but, I'll never forget it, How about it, we dude. call him Maxim Bikini Issue <laughs> Kelly? <laughs> oh, dude, that was the best. Dude, it was so cool. Oh, fuck it, Max. You remind me of that one time. <laughs> they, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Maxim <laughs> Kelly <laughs> named it after his Maxim weekend. <laughs> it was a six month road gig. Ma- Maxim Girl Search. Yeah. Went into these cities, got all these girls mm-hmm. uh, to Le- come and oh, do. Oh, so you're saying they were fake? That they were already- No, they were girls, but they were like. They are brought in? They, were, they had to do like. <laughs> they Pros? Had to, they had to throw, they had to like dance. There was a dance segment. It was almost like a, you know, um, like a, a, a Miss pageant, America, like a Miss America pageant. But Maxim Magazine, all guys, and Coors Light sponsored. It was just drunk fucking dudes. I would go out and do a little stand up, bring these girls out, and they would do the weirdest shit to get the guys revved up, show their tits to, to win. And they picked a girl from each city, Philly and Cleveland. And, so we went hometown hotties. Yeah, hometown but hotties. I got in trouble one night because I said a girl spun. To get the crowd into it, she spun on her neck, Ooh. and her ass was hanging out. Mm. Cool. And I, w- I went, God damn, and I got yelled at. For what? Saying God damn. Using yeah, the name in vain? Cor- cultural Cor- appropriation. Coors Light, Light is uh, run by a very religious family. The Coors. And there was reps really? there. Peter, Peter Coors. There was reps there, and they were like, yeah. can you not say? I go, yeah, but her vagina was hanging out. And they're like, that's cool. It's Pete Coors. But don't right use now. the Lord's name in vain. So I was like, Whoa. Mike, That's you're not insane. listening to me. His name is Pete Coors. Type in Pete Coors. Pete Coors. I, He's the guy that runs it. I understand. From that. Colorado. I'm telling you, just fight Google. back, Mike. Fight back. No, I'm telling him that I have Mike? the information. He's not listening to the information. I He's told, going to Wikipedia. That's what I told him. I told you. He's it's Pete Coors the Alley. Hey, that's pretty fun. Wasn't what bad. are you doing, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> Mike just gave you an upset wife look. <laughs> He we gave went, me a look Robert, like we've talked tears about in this. His eyes. Goes, Robert, we stop were it. not going to fight in public. Robert, stop it. You know I'm working hard. You know I'm under a lot of stress. I just know of course, of course, like being the beer for smoking the bandit. So. Yeah, and I'm from Colorado, where we know all of the information about the Coors family. Well, then just tell him that he's right. Pete Coors is who ran it. Can you please he, type? Please really look at Chairman type? Peter Coors right there. Click Thank it. you. Man, unsuccessfully. Oh, click his God. fucking name, Mike. Damn it. Pete Coors. By the way, Pete Coors. Big up to Pete Coors. One of the guys that pushed legalization of marijuana in Colorado. Yeah, that's that's good. 
Well, he was a Republican. That was a big deal. Whatever. He came through and said the twenty five percent needs to go to school. And t- uh, now, now he's one of them. Now you fucking shows. They're looking at you like you're retarded at the, all your shows. What's that? I don't know. I just said something. <laughs> Did you get that all out? I was just violent fat. crimes dropped and the money. Has that, it really? Yeah. 30. Wait a minute. In Denver, yeah. violent yeah. Con- crime is dropped. Look it up. Thirty two percent. I don't need to look it up. I trust you. Mm-hmm. I'm asking you. It's great. It's good for the. Co- it's good for the state. Everyone. Should- yeah, everyone's getting so, high, doggy. Recreational hey, marijuana, doggy, please. Doggy, doggy, doggy. Yeah. Can't you see? see? Some. Sometimes your love just hypnotize me, and I just love your flashy ways. It's my favorite Bon Jovi song. Yeah. It's not Bon Jovi. Yeah, it is. The keyboard on it says. I'll bet you $5,000. Okay. Dude, please bet that that's a Bon Jovi song, because I'm going to watch you piss away $5,000. What? It's won $5,000. No, you didn't. (laughs) It's not a Bon Jovi song. Can you bring up $5,000? Right, Gabby? It's a Bon Jovi song. Can you bring up that song? Hypnotize. They're on a boat, they're all dancing. Come on, Gabby. Hmm. For us. Yeah, so doggy, yes. doggy, 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 can't yes. you yeah. see? Sometimes you love just hypnotize. Hypnotize, Bon Jovi, look it up. That's a, that's a call. Bon Jovi, so what are they? are on a boat. We'll look at the video. So what do God? The well, video for Hypnotize was great. It's on the, no. the album. Uh, it's Biggie Smalls. Life After Death. It's Biggie Smalls. No, look. When Biggie is. died, I got one of his hats. Don't do that. <laughs> we, can't, we can't play it. Yeah, whatever. You anyway. can't play it? Wow. You well, know what's great about Gas Digital? We can just play whatever music we want. That's racist. Yeah, because you're behind a paywall. No, we're not. We're actually all of our live streams are free. I love when you say something to Lewis. And he's no, it's just, it's he just really, he really does. Really, he just that high voice. He goes, "Think of information." Well, he goes like this. No, well, actually, no, it's no, really no, actually. No, no. I like, oh, re- oh, I, like re- I like retorting, actually, yeah. retorting Lewis. Yeah. Actually, no, it's pretty funny because uh, and I like nice. retorted actually, Dan. <laughs> that's good. You know what? Hey, <laughs> even though it hurt my feelings, it was good. <laughs> <Did> it <hurt? laughs> no. Okay. So uh, it, hurt when you, when, it hurt when he said that all you guys quit our show except me. Can you judge the roast battle tonight <laughs> at eight? Oh, oh no, you have to do the uh, Patrice O'Neill's benefit. Can you judge, guys judge the roast battle can at eight? Can you cancel it, dog? Why are you getting people today? I got spots. Yeah, why don't you book in advance? Because I'd like yeah. to do it in advance. I would, I would do it. Why don't you call like in a week? Yeah, exactly. yeah, a week in advance. Eight to nine week. o'clock. It's an hour, doggy. Have I Gabby got do spots. it. I got spots. I have an eight forty. Gabby is not cool. Whoa. Um, I think you're cool. No, I'm kidding. She's Thanks. really hot. Yeah, Hello. don't fucking embarrass her. She gets very blotchy. Do you get I'm blotchy? made of paper. Yes, look at her cheeks get blotchy when she's I get nervous. very blotchy. Yeah, that naturally. green paper. Yeah. Private jets. Money, money, money. Biggie, biggie, biggie. <laughs> can't you see? Oh, it is biggie. Yeah, yeah it's 5000 $5, dude. Yeah, 5000 <laughs> I'll take it in gas digital money. Uh, birthdays was the God worst damn days. It. Now we sip champagne that is when 1, we're That 1,000 sandwiches. Ugh, the sandwich joke sucks. <laughs> it was good with the 250. That was it wasn't right. even good then. It was, right. was all right. I liked it then. <laughs> wasn't even good then. All right, guys, wrap this up. That's Dan's it? No. Go. Read. No. What? no. We got another hour it's and a half. No, we wrap it up. It usually takes a half hour. So have you ever done the show before? Do you have any weed? I do, yes. I mean, no. <laughs> hey, folks, March 20th. Check out my Netflix half hour special, The Stand Up Season 2. That's right, March 20th. You guys got Brooklyn in over there? Say that again? <laughs> <laughs> did I really did mumble that out. All right, this sponsor, I love them. Brooklinen.com. You've heard me talk about them. It's sheets, it's bedding, but they're unbelievable. I love good sheets, I love bedding. I bought, I bought these. They sent them to me. I bought pairs. I, I bought them for people as presents. With brooklinen.com, you can get the high-quality sheets and bedding you deserve without the luxury retail prices or the overwhelming big-box store shopping experience. Sleeping on a great sheet is an easy way to upgrade your nightly routine and help you feel more well-rested every day. But most high-end quality bedding is marked up by more than 300% by the time it reaches the stores. Brooklinen makes quality luxury sheets and bedding for everyone. All right, Brooklinen was founded in April 2014 by husband and wife team Vicki and Rich Fuller on the philosophy that people deserve simple, beautiful home essentials without the luxury prices. Brooklinen cuts out the unnecessary markups, the retail licensing fees, and the manufacturing waste in order to offer a high-end design and exceptional savings across their collection. Brooklyn is the fastest growing bedding brand in the world because people love these products. Their sheets have over 12,000 five-star reviews. Brooklyn and sheets were named the winner of the best of online bedding category by Good Housekeeping. Brooklyn and all season down comforter was rated the number one best comforter by New York Times. Wire cutter blog, they have versatile colors and patterns and you can mix and match to 
complement any decor. This is luxury bedding, underpriced. You have to try these sheets. You got to try them. Here's the deal, okay? I love my Brooklyn and sheets. I want you to try these sheets, and I know you'll love them too. Brooklyn has an exclusive offer just for my listeners. Get $20 off and free shipping when you use promo code WHATDUDE. That's what dude at brooklinen.com. In fact, Brooklyn is so confident that you'll love your new sheets. They offer a risk-free 60-night satisfaction guarantee and a lifetime warranty on all their sheets and comforters. There's no reason not to give these sheets a try. The only way to get the $20 off and the free shipping is to use promo code what dude at brooklinen.com. That's brooklinen.com. Promo code what dude at brooklinen.com. These sheets are the best. So there you go. Um, anyways, anything on gun control? <laughs> wow, wow, you're going to get real serious, huh? Not Debbie's you, Gabby's dad. dad. Debbie's dad beat it. We're, trying to, we're, we're trying, trying to make to your, your daughter, daughter come. Yeah, we're trying to get her all slippery when wet. You know, I just want to ask him one question. Is Gabby, Gabby's dad, uh, Gabby's dad, Gabby's dad. Gabby's dad. Oh God, Michael, you're a fucking moron. I oh just my did God. The joke. Why would we do it again? Because we, because I do what I. Yeah, you don't know timing, Bobby. I didn't know you were. Gonna <laughs> Michael, I want to fucking yeah, do it all you don't the know time. Timing. Mike Suarez of the Texas comedy scene knows timing. <laughs> name, stinks. But why would you? If I say I want to do it again, he goes, "Dude, I just did it. Why would we do it again? <laughs> None of your business. Push the button, you, button why boy. Would you, but why would you tag up a joke when there's a punchline? <laughs> I'm gonna fucking kill this guy that works for billions. I'm why? What happened? Fuck. He, he I'm, I'm fucked for tomorrow. Why? Why? Because he fucked up. He what are you talking up. about? I, he, I just got a text that says I have to work all day tomorrow. And why? He, What's wrong with that? I'm supposed to do his podcast. I'm supposed to do my radio show. Oh, you cancel on my podcast tomorrow? Uh, yeah. Well, why don't for you billions? Deal with this I'll deal with him right now. Oh, give me. God, give me the phone. I'm, I'm gonna <laughs> let it go. I'll deal with him. Give me. You fucking give me. Touch my phone. Give me the, the fucking phone. Are you kidding, kidding me? Be a big man. Give me the oh, no, phone. Well, this, this is this is quite a predicament. Shoot billions or do the real ass podcast? I mean, these are the moments that really fuck with you. This guy just and I'm not gonna. This guy's just fucked up a lot. And I'm like telling him, I'm like. No, I'm not going to give you the fuck. They don't fuck up a lot, Dan. You know what happens? No, this guy's fucked up a lot this season, Bobby. I'm they, telling you I'm that. I'm telling you right now, they don't... Listen, can I tell you? This is, I'm, I don't know if this is true, but my... Because I've had this happen to me on shows. They don't care. No, here's the they deal. They don't care. I've they had say, si- Hold on. I've had side conversations with this guy yeah, several times. And they don't care. He's the only AD that fucks up. They don't care. Okay. They don't care. Okay. Oh, dude. You know, yeah, yeah, no problem. No, no, no. no problem. No, and then they, I know they, they have... Go, the, I've, th- I know an AD that fucked up. Penn State athletic director. Oh! Raping kids. Fucking them in the shower, which is similar to what happened. This is basically, I feel like a kid that's been No, it wasn't in the, in the shower. It was in their Maybe butthole. Guy... He wasn't the AD. He was the uh, defensive coordinator. Maybe this guy just says, yeah, yeah, I well, got no, you. Well, no, but he was just... the I think he athletic does. director. I think, I think he just says, yeah, yeah, I got you. Yeah. Don't worry about it. And so then that, goes... that's why I just had to send him a text where I'm like, well, no. You're that's... not going. I go read your text above. Yes. So you're still in the real ass podcast yes. tomorrow. I mean, I'm going to try. Wow. Yes. If it goes up and the producers call me and they go, can I say something? Do billions? Yeah, uh, I don't. yeah. No, don't listen to fucking Bob Kelly. Well, this it's not fucking, that sense. Don't this, listen. To this guy loser. fucked up. So don't I want listen this guy. to this fucking this waste guy. of time. Uh, Do billions. It's a better show than the Real Ass Podcast. Yes, debatable. No, Real Ass Podcast is the new best podcast in the world, dude. Look on the internet. It's look not on true. It. It's fucking. I'm Come Town is the new best podcast. Come Town. That's is huge, bro. Huge. Town, it's Twenty-seven great. It's great. grand a month, it's dog. Great. Huge. Huge. Doggy. Yeah, but are you, how are you, why do people judge it based off the amount of money they make? That doesn't mean anything. It's a great, po- I've listened to it. It's amazing. Oh, it's, it's so funny. funny. It's a, It's probably the best podcast out there right now. Yeah. yeah. What? Come Town? Come Town. Yeah, with the I mean, name, funny with the name come in the title. It's not better than Real Ass Podcast or Lose You to Skanks. But oh, it's better it than definitely no. better than Have you ever heard Tuesdays with Stories? We got a lot of listeners. No, I haven't. <laughs> Who's in that? <laughs> it's Mark Norman and myself, and who I have myself? a Netflix special. Who? <laughs> Coming out who March twentieth. Oh. It's uh, season two of the stand ups. Yeah. You can catch season one right now featuring our pal Dan Soder right. and our pal Nate Bargatze. And Louis Gomez. Louis J. Gomez. Maybe if he had moved to LA those years ago. If, sorry about that. You really fucked him. I fucked him? Yeah. I think I saved him. Look at that. That's a good headshot. If I if Look I didn't, the size if I didn't, of my forehead. If my I didn't God. get him to not go to LA, he would still be married right now. Married. In LA. He was never married. Or with your wife, or with B. No, that wouldn't have uh, that wouldn't have happened either. Season two of Netflix, the stand-ups feature. Wow. Yep. 
Skip Why that is one. your name not f- first? Body? I'm more. What I'm are, more than them. What are you? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't understand. That's why. a little hurtful, to be honest. Why is your name that. not there? I know. It's only two poor people. Why couldn't yeah. they just fit in the two more people? And my name's the shortest name. Yeah. Seven letters. Maybe they, thought, maybe they thought List was going to confuse, well, you know. Three of you. Yeah, but it's such an easy Four name, too. Ginny is sheer. And I don't have my photo. Oh, there's my photo. Ginny is sheer. Kyle Kinane. It's Yasha Ray. Oh, wow. What's her name? Apparanana Nakajaracha. Pardon and Charla. Pardon and Charla. Apparanana Palalala Chacha. Wow, look at that. That's. I mean, that is the most diverse lineup I've ever seen. That is a gr- that is a perfectly diverse lineup. Am I out of my mind? I mean, I thought our season one was pretty diverse. It's weird that they have three gay guys, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! 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 That's a woman. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> that was pretty good. Joe, why does your forehead look like that? Um, <laughs> you really do. You really do have a I don't it know. Looks what like it looks like there's a strong it. wind blowing directly in your face. Yeah, you really do look like John Cusack. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Well, John Cusack is very attractive, and so yeah, I appreciate it. You look more like John Cusack. That, that strong wind blowing my face, Lewis, is called like industry heat. Boom. <laughs> Ever hear of it? No. <laughs> I know. That was my joke. Kyle Kinane has a smaller forehead than you. Mm. For sure. He's bald. Looks like Kyle Kinane <laughs> lent you some of his forehead. Oh, Jesus. Why did okay. you follow my joke? Yeah, yeah. I bombed. Yeah, Why would stinks. You? <laughs> Rachel looks like she's waiting for the rest of that joke. <laughs> Rachel looks like she lent you some of Kyle Kinane's forehead. Oof. Yikes. Yes. Gina looks like her penis just slipped out. Start telling friends, everybody. March 20th. <laughs> I'm not getting a publicist. Instead of that, I'm coming on here to the You Know What yeah. Do podcast. I'm going to get them 300 people at a time. So all 300 <laughs> of you, tell your friends. Season two, stand-ups, March 20th. Watch season one right now. Right, right now. You ask you not your get, dad watch to season ask one right now. Specifically to episode it. six. Just uh, go to episode did six. Did you get a pop when, you, when you're from this? Do you think you're... His pop six. passed away many years ago. Yeah. No, 1997. Bobby just wants soda. <laughs> yeah. Dude, did they give you sodas? <laughs> oh, we got it. Um, did you... Yeah. Did, it really helped you. you yeah, it, it's it, a world of difference being on Netflix. Really? Yeah. Hot dog. Don't write difference. mean things to me, though. It bums me out. Who Stop being a bitch. Things? People write mean things. What did they say? They write say, the oh, a bitch. look at you. Your dick's too big. Oh, <laughs> your face is perfect. Your jokes are great. Uh, <laughs> stuff like that. <laughs> so you're saying don't send them? Old, old Uncle Joe, huge dick. <laughs> oh, lip ripper list. Oh. <laughs> lip ripper. What does lip that ripper. mean? Lip ripper. Pussy, Pussy, Pussy ripper. Oh, oh. I'm a pee. <laughs> I gotta pee too. I like the show better when I was peeing 20 times an episode. Yeah, what was that about you? Because I was on drugs. Yeah. <laughs> so I had Molly and then lied to Vita's wife. She hates him now. <laughs> he told me to lie and then he fucking turned on me. Gary. Oh, oh Gary shit. Vita? His wife hates him. Why? Hates Soder. Why? She Gary, texted me. She, his why does Gary, why, what? <laughs> his wife's a little wacky. Dude, you're about to say she sucks. No, she doesn't <laughs> suck. She <laughs> just. <laughs> What the I fuck? feel bad for Gary. He just shouldn't have gotten married. Why? You don't like his wife? No, his wife's cool, but it's just like, here's the thing. Ready? It's a I'm chick. Because I, I had him on the show yesterday, and he was like, uh, I was like, why'd you get married? He was like, ah, you know, she just wanted to do it. You know, because what happens, girls will start doing this. Like, oh, when are we getting married? And a chick who starts to question that and starts to push for that is the same type of chick that three years into the relationship, you're in fucking couples therapy because they need to move on to the next thing. They're impatient. The whole fuck a young chick that wants to comic? get married. No, but a young chick that wants to get married. There's fucking something about that. That's all like women want to get married. No, not all women. But Gabby, you want to get married? I don't really care. Yeah, but she's 23. Yeah, and when she's 23 and a half, well, she'll want to get married. She's a girl. Hmm? You're a girl. You're not a woman. <laughs> <laughs> but you would like to get married. Do you have a boyfriend, Maybe Gary? But you want to be picked. That's call the thing with marriage. You want to get picked. I, did I call you Gary? Call her Gary. Gabby. <laughs> Gabby, you don't have a boyfriend. No. No. I'm only kidding. His, his, by the way, his wife doesn't hate Soder, but she was mad at him. Because Soder lied to she her. She hates Lewis now because he just <laughs> called her said she sucks. <laughs> but she was mad at Soder because Soder had to lie about some about concert. What? They went to a concert and did drugs. Why would you thing. lie about to your wife? Just tell her. I don't Why know. Why would you say, I'm going to a concert and I'm going to fucking do drugs? Why would you lie? Why do you have to lie about it? I don't know. I mean, that's a bad sign. Here, that's a bad no, sign. Here, this, because I know it. I know exactly what it is. You don't want to, or you want, you want to avoid the argument, and you say, "Fuck it." If I lie, I'll avoid the argument. But then when you get caught in the lie, then it just adds a whole other level of distrust into the relationship. So whatever the stupid thing you're lying about is not even that big of a deal. But that's like my whole life with my ex. 
He would catch me on, like, dumb lies all the time, and then it just created this whole, like, everything seemed like it was a lie. Yeah. The, just, the distrust is there. Yeah. And you can't get rid of it. State of love and trust as I JBJ? bust it down to pretext. No. no. Different band. Yeah, because once you break somebody's trust, it's hard to give it back. Yeah. And it's not you have to earn it. You can literally just give it back. Because it's always been a matter of trust. You don't want to cross that line. JBJ? Billy Joel. BJ. BJ. Yeah. I'll take one. <laughs> you don't want to cross the line. As long as once you cross that line, it's like, yeah, I, there, it's, there's always a moment in a relationship where you go like, fuck, dude, I really wish we didn't go there because now it's never going to be back. Hey, too, what? But you can get you can get trust back. It just takes a long time for that person to decide to do it. What I would talk to her. Breaking trust? Uh, no, about uh, Vita having a lie. You having a lie to Vita's wife. That made me so, I mean, I talked to Gary about it, but it made me so mad. And she found out. Which, How did she find out? Because uh, he told her. No way. <laughs> yeah. He said lie to my wife and then fucking told the truth. Yeah, that's out of line. Yeah, that's fucked up. Yeah, it is. I was fucking furious. That's crazy. He's like, he's like, my wife hates you. I'm like, I don't care. It's your fault. Fuck her. That's your fault. Well, Deal I, with it. I don't know if you have to say fuck. Her. I don't give a shit. I, no, if you're in a relationship, you should be fucking. Of course. Yeah, well, no. But it, it, I'm also fired up from the other thing, so I'm gonna come in. Like, I just go. Do, are you still I had fucking 14 missed calls, and when I was peeing, I looked. I was like, Jesus. No, I can't do real ass podcast anymore. Can we do it next Wednesday? Can I come on? Oh boy, that's gonna oh. sink the whole podcast. No, it's not. Joe, you want to do it? Can you do it with Nick Mullen tomorrow? I can. I got therapy. My therapy is from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. So don't even. Lewis, today, just say no to me. <laughs> the time be fucking. What'd you say? His therapy is from 11. 11 what was it 11 a.m. to 5 p.m.? Yeah, that was a good one. <laughs> I, here's the thing. I love book, real ass can, podcasts. It's a little tough to get there. It's very difficult to get there. Where is it's it? Not the, it's the East Village. It's not, it's it's not East Village. It's you Alphabet the, City. You take the end, Be honest. You take the end it's of Alphabet City. Union Square. And then, and then you walk for six days. No, you take the L to First Avenue and then you walk down to 12th and. Yeah, you go to the L to First Avenue, stupid. It's 70 minutes from my house. It takes 50. All right. That's 50. a lot. That's an hour. But 50 if you fucking nail it. Yeah, just let it go. You can't do it. You know. Stop trying to please everybody. Yeah, stop right. trying to please everybody. Yeah, oh, I feel pleaser. bad because I told Lewis I'd do it. I know it. you feel bad. You can feel bad. I just bad found out that you I can't do, do it. I created an image for the whole show. He did, show. and I liked it, and I really wanted to go on the still use the image. Just cross his face out. By the way, Vita's the Why best. Why don't you have Gabby on? Gabby, you want to come on? Do it, Gabby. Sure. Sweet. There you go. All right. You can interrogate her all you want tomorrow. Okay. I mean, just pull it out of her. Whoa. And then Whoa. Put it I'll back pull something in. out. Oh, guys. What? what, your dick, you mean? Yeah. <laughs> I don't my think dick. I can co sign dick on this. <laughs> um, I feel bad. Gary Veter's the best. And, uh, I love Gary. He's one of my favorite, and favorite people in the world, but I'm fucking pissed about that shit. He's a killer comic. I was you should check I was, him out. He's all right. If you have your friend lie to your wife and then you fucking undersell your friend, that's fucked up. Undersell. It's not good. Sell Undercut. Out. It's not Undercut. good because sell out. Undercut. It's almost like so. when you when you Under, fight out. when you uh, fight with so. your girl, and then she goes and tells all her girlfriends what a piece of shit you are, yeah. and then you make up, and she doesn't go back and say, "Look, yes. I was yes. fucking yes. Wrong too." Good point. Yes. Good it's point. like fuck you. now. Now you show up, and they're looking at you like they still hate you. Yeah. And she didn't fucking make it right. She goes, "No, it's okay." So he <laughs> needs to make it right. Yeah. He needs yeah. to go to. His I think wife. he has. I think he made it right. I think he was like, "You got to don't hate Dan. It's in my best interest for you to like him." No, you need to say. I you can't need, open him for this guy. I think you're good. Him. No, he's not open for me. I think need, I think you're good. You need to say, listen, honey, it's not him. It was me. I made him lie. I feel bad that I started this. I was only trying to be funny and make Dan upset. Well, I already was upset. All right, so. let's go back to Dan, uh, to Gabby losing her virginity. Yeah. So Gabby, 18 years old. 18. To Bon Jovi. How long were you dating the guy? Oh no. Jesus. <laughs> oh, Gabby's dad's here. Never mind. It's 2012. Shh, I'm gonna there. put it. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna put it out there. This bit's done. That bit's done. I liked it. And I, I liked it, it too, said, but we went too far. Then you yelled. It's a whole thing. Nah, well, Mike, Mike I want to hear from you. I want to hear from the real Mike. Mm -hmm. yeah, Mike, what do you think? Bust something out here. <laughs> <laughs> Gabby, how long were you, how long were you dating the guy? Pass. <laughs> you can't pass. Can you at least button your shirt when they're asking these I'm dirty gonna questions? I'm going to tell you this. Oh, Whoa. Yeah. Real ass dude, on the real ass <laughs> podcast, you're not going to be able to pass. Could you? Are you related uh, to Gabby Gifford? No. Okay. <laughs> Does your, do you still talk Classic to your real gag. mom? Sometimes. Really? But your, your stepmom is... Your, is yeah. Right, okay. Wow, so your mom... You don't talk to your mom, mom, really. Mm, Let me ask you this. Right. You would think with the rock star dad, you wouldn't speak to the dad. I would, I know, are you kidding me? Reverse. I'd stay with the fucking awesome rock star dad. Hell yeah, I'd live on a tour bus. Yeah. Why? Now, Mommy now, ain't giving you private jets. I tried to stay with my dad. Mom works at Target. My dad was a bartender <laughs> alcoholic. I tried to stay <laughs> with him. Your, no, your other moms must be loaded, though. She got divorced and got a check, right? 
She's got that fucking oh, she, first three yeah, albums she money. She lives in the middle of Pennsylvania. Money she's got money isn't from, right? everything, but it is a lot. Oh, you never talk to her. No, I talk to her. I don't now, talk to her about her. Do you have a, do you have, can you go home whenever you want and there's an awesome room and do whatever you want, like a big house? What do you mean? Do, do you, whatever I want when I like go home. Like when you go home, can you do you, take you a have, shit in the drapes? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> almost That's every time I go home. Master with with masturbate with the kitchenware. Do you have a pool? Ooh. Uh, yeah. Do you have a hot tub? Yeah. Obviously stupid. Let's go. Let's have a party at your house. What do you mean stupid? Yeah, Shut do you have the a, fuck do you have a grotto? Yeah. I haven't lived there. So Obviously, she has a fucking pool and a hot tub. Some people Her just have a pools. rock star. Some people just have pools. Oh, it's just shaped. Hold on. Is, hold on. Is the pool shaped like a keyboard? Ah, uh, cool. No, it's not. No, no. How cool would that be? Don't well, do I don't that. live there. I moved out like do that. <laughs> seven years ago. I, I do. He doesn't move. Oh, no. Dan shivers like a. Puppy. Wait, you moved out seven years ago? You were sixteen. Go. No, you... I moved out when I went to college. Oh, that makes sense. Where'd you go to college? Pace. Clown Downtown. college. Clown college. <laughs> hey, I'm here, guys. Hi. I'm here to learn how to do profiles. <laughs> I find your fu- your voice to be very normal. Thanks, Joe. You're welcome. Thanks, Joe. You're my favorite. Thank you. Well, that makes your voice goes with your mouth. <laughs> Sorry. Hmm? I, <laughs> Lewis got put it down to bronze. <laughs> I said your favorite. A, Shut up, Gabby. You like Lewis is bronze. You like him the best? <laughs> no, I like Joe the best. Thank you, Gabby. I appreciate that. But if you had a kiss, if you had to make out with one of us, who would it be? Dan. Yeah! Oh! Second. Only because I'm married, I assume. Second. You're not going <laughs> to fucking make up with that little mouth. Come on. Yeah. It sucks. Yeah. Look at it. Look like, how much that would suck to kiss. That looks like a regular, <laughs> that looks like a regular mouth got burnt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Trying to make out with a pool jet. <laughs> hey, hey, turtle. It's like the hole in the Mr. Potato Head. Like, I should put a real mouth into it. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody loves Dan, though. It really bugs Yeah, me. I get it. All right, Dan's, you know, he's, he's rugged. He's a little prince. Rugged? Yeah. He's not fucking rugged. He's rugged, yeah, yeah. Look at him. A, you, you're fucking Dan looks like he could ride a horse. He looks yeah. like he picks a car. He does not. Yes, yeah, he I does. do. He yes, he does. I know I, know I can't. Like? I know I can't. But it looks I look like he works at a 7 Eleven or a fucking like a, a movie store. I'm rugged. There we go. Rugged. Dan looks like these guys. Are Thank you, you. Dan does not look like any of those guys. Uh, Michael Fassbender, deal. Wait, no way. What was the last year you were in a 7 Eleven? Yeah. I was the one in last week. He looked like that? Yeah, but in Jersey. Even in Jersey, I don't know. You have to go to Nebraska to have a Seven Eleven guy look you like that. You think Dan Soda looks like any of these fucking Hold on, guys? Go on. Gabby? Yes, one. Or, I think if Dan look at the third one. The third one. That, Dan, that could be Dan's Steve dad. Steve McQueen. That could Steve, be Dan's are dad. You Steve fucking, McQueen. Yeah, his dad, not him. Thank the you. only thing similar yes. to, to Soder and Steve McQueen uh. is that Soder is similar to a queen. <laughs> Hey, can I ask this soda? Why don't you pursue Gabby? Can She's into you. Bring up yeah, Gabby is Time out, dude. Gabby's fucking Claire. hot, and you could Claire's. fuck her. I mean, Lewis, Lewis. Let's, can we just let's make it? Down. Can we beat civilians let's here? Let's calm down. Bring can we up be clerks. civilized? Bring up clerks. That's what Dan looks you like. You think that's Dan? That's Dan. No. That's Dan. No. A Thanks. fucking convenience store in Jersey. No. On the right, down the bottom, doesn't look like Bobby. I'm rugged. Get over it, dude. <laughs> look at look at the I guy. Saddle up Gabby's pony. The guy with the hat. Go get some fresh Lewis, drinking the water. The guy with the hat backwards <laughs> doesn't look like Dan. I got a kind clean. of yes. That's the- thing. Dan, where are you going to be? I will be at Ch- Zanies in Chicago, Ooh. St. Louis Helium, Zanies Nashville, wow. and then uh, Los Angeles with the Legion of Skanks. Who's that? Where's the uh, Skanks uh, show? Yeah, we're going to be at the Comedy, Comedy Store. Store the 28th uh, for the live podcast on Wednesday night at the Belly Room. Then live stand-up <laughs> show, Legion of Skanks for, and Friends at, uh, yeah, those are old dates, not on the website, um, uh, on the 29th. And we got... Uh, Who's fucking what? doing that? 
That was so Joe. You yeah. I love that you could <laughs> Joe. <laughs> peg you in the fucking head, Joe. You fucking Why? asshole. I'm letting you go like this. Go, Why are you <laughs> mad? <laughs> I have like a thing. I have a small <laughs> mouth. Joe's going like this. And yeah. I have, sometimes I have acid <laughs> reflux. It's a small. Yeah, you got uh, girth. Leave him alone. <laughs> this is Joe. March 23rd, 24th, me and Dave Smith co-headlining Nick's Comedy Stop. And then uh, the 25th or the 30th will be in Los Angeles. And uh, yeah, GomezComedy.com. Then the Roastmasters we do every Tuesday at the stand. And you get free tickets if you use the promo yeah. code RAP. And you can judge it if you're available within an hour of the show. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's an hour show, so yeah, I'd see who's around. Uh, my shut funny, up and take it. Uh, I know, but you should fucking up. Up. give me t- two weeks in advance. Yeah, I'd love Joe, to commit. I try to book you on Skanks and Roast Battle every time you go, yeah, dude, I don't carry my book on me, so I guess. No, you book it. You don't carry your book. What do I, I Why are you yelling at Joe? Lewis, what don't do I say? Just give me two weeks in advance. Then I cancel. <laughs> I never cancel. Ah, Check out my other yeah. podcast, Real Ass Podcast, <laughs> which I'll be on in the next two weeks or so. And <laughs> believe you me, with UFC fighter Michael Bisping. Yeah, the oh, count. Available my gas digital network, and all the gas digital live streams are now free. So yeah. Merch pump. Joey, what and do you And merch pump. Merch pump. Merch pump. A bunch yes. of cool shit. Get your YKWD hoodie at merch pump. And get some other cool gear. What do you got, Joe? March 20th, I will be <laughs> on Netflix starting yeah. March 20th. Very excited Woo. about this. Thank you. Season and two here, of the stand ups. Here's the thing everybody on all the podcasts you do, anybody who listen to this, when you see Joe tweet it, when you see us tweet it or put it out there, retweet it, spread the word. Spread the word. Don't just look at it. Help spread the word of this special. Watch Joe. He's the first one out the gate. Thank you. So make sure that everybody gets behind this special. So the anal- what do you put your thumb down for? So that everybody gets behind this special and that the analytics are crazy. So they, they, they fucking know that Joe has a ton of fans. Cause Thank it's, you. It's going to be a great special. That'd be great. Yeah, and I was going to get a publicist, but they cost $75,000. $12,000. Yes, so I'm not. So if you okay. guys could be what? my publicist. No, there's that I said? much. It's not that much. 12000 Well, I'm going to get three months. Good one. Anyways, so, and then uh, also Comedian Joe, and I just found this out. My website that we're looking at, Comedian Joe List, has a mailing. You can go sign up on my mailing list Where? somehow on there. I don't know. But I'm because I'm an idiot. But right where it says mailing list? Yeah, yeah. Sign up for my mailing list. <laughs> yeah, guys, you know it's 2008. Everyone's using a mailing list now. Can I say something about that? Or, uh, will you not drop my fucking microphone? Gentle. Why Asshole. would you not? Who shits the, uh, on a mailing uh, list? Yeah, dude. Even make mailing sense. lists are coming back. Yeah. Are they? Well, I swear to God. Email list. We're not. Send, they're not going to send. They're called mailing anybody. email lists. They're coming back. Yeah. A lot of people are trying to get emails again. Yeah. Why would you not? You email the people. That's what Louis made his whole career off of that. What? Jerking in front of him. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's got the email. He sends out an email saying, "Hey, I got a new special," and they may buy it. That's yeah. how Horace and Pete did so well. Thank you, Mike. Thank Anyways, you. comedian Joe List, sign up to be as awesome. part of my mailing list. I won't bombard you. You know it because I didn't even know I had a fucking mailing list. And uh, comedianjoelist.com. I'm coming to Ann Arbor. I'll move on. I took up too much of your time. Netflix. You did. You took up a lot. I mean, I gave you a big plug. Tuesdays with stories. Oh God! Every Tuesday. Go to my fucking thing, Michael. Please. <laughs> uh, where am I, Mike? You're going to be at uh, Uncle Vinny's this weekend. Yep. On the 24th. You got uh, yep. flat, uh, show the Fat Black next Wednesday. I'm going to be at the Mystic Lake Casino with uh, Mike Feeney for uh, the t- the 2nd and the 3rd of March. And then I'm at the Karras. What is that? The, the Carlson? Carl- the Carlson at Rochester. The Carlson. I can't read that. That was Comedy at the Carlson. All right. And then I'm uh, and then I got a, I'm hosting JFL uh, Nasty Show this summer. Yep. Hey, dickheads. Can you fucking pay attention? Yeah, Maybe help me plug show this, uh, this yeah. summer. Yeah, this yeah. I sat there and fucking plugged your stupid days. Yeah, we're, we're helping you plug. No, you're not. You're making out with show. each other, doing tiny things. I was trying to. I was really trying. I was hoping. To Why don't close you the fucking? Deal. I, I sit there and plug your shit. Bobby, sorry guys, sorry guys. Bro, we, Bobby needs support show. when he does. Thank plug. you. Okay, yeah. go, go. Okay, go. go. Uh, go. Uh, you go. You plug him for me. Okay, Bobby will be at the nasty show this summer at Just for Laughs in Montreal. It's a ghost theme show. So much fun. Bobby Kennedy and Just for Labs. I can't wait to be there and see it. Cap City in June. And then a spooky trip to Atlanta. (laughs) Also in June. Where am I playing? The Laughing Skull. It's a great club. Thank you. That was much better. Thank you very much. You're welcome. I love you. I love you too. I gotta Um, go fucking yell at somebody. Are you gonna yell at people? Yeah. Uh, Corporate Dan's about to get real corporate. 
So anyways, make sure. Uh, Gabby, what do you got? Um, check out my Instagram. I post everything on there. I got a couple bar and basement shows coming up. Yeah. yeah. And a roast battle. We're going to do it in April, right, guys? Or March? Sure. March or April? April. April. Uh, April be better. Why April? Because of my schedule. I have a broken foot. I think uh, me, Joe, and Dan are judging it, right? You're going to all judge it, 100%. <laughs> Perfect. What do you got? I'll be at the Improv in San Antonio this week featuring. I'll be at uh, Hyenas in Dallas next weekend. And in April, I'll be with Gina Brion at the Laugh Out Loud in San Antonio. Yeah. Yeah. Tejas. Zach eight. Zach, the new guy. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Good Zach, plug. I found out, loves uh, Gilmore Girls. Yeah. Good for Zach. And wrestling. But, yeah, wrestling. Too I'm, sweet. Uh, according to the post show, guess I'm what's wrong with America because I'm a wrestling fan. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> Ashton. He was Ashton. making a joke about racist, but that was. Guys, thanks for showing up. What's your name again, dude? Shimon. Shimon. Do you have a good time? Shimon. Yeah. Hello, Jew. What would you say? Hello, Jew. I said fellow Jew. Oh, fellow Jew. Shh. Um, it's all right. It's all right, dude. Don't yeah, worry about fine. Shimon. Don't fight Shimon. Me. Yes. Shimon. Oh, do you have, do you have a good Drew. time, buddy? The best. Thanks for coming in, man. And My first podcast to come on. Oh no, shit. That's great. Up and coming comic. Oh, good for you. Man. <laughs> You're a comic. <laughs> I wish I was. Where did you get that oh, shirt? Yeah, I want the, Where'd you get that shirt? I like it. It's uh, LV. I like the uh, the You're buttons right? on the shoulder. It's kind of hot. LV, LV. Yeah. That's it. Thanks I'm for coming on, buddy. I might as well look, you know, look the part. Yeah, you look great, dude. Let's wrap it up. Shoulder studs. All right. Oh yeah. And, I love uh, you, Bobby. Who the fuck are you? I don't know, but we that's wrap just it up. Oh, yeah. why? Because Dan, Dan has to leave, and we yeah. have to take a picture. I'll wrap it up when I fucking wrap it up. Yeah, yeah. You stole Stupid. part of my heart. This is. La- I think serious. Gabby and I are gonna be a power couple. Why KWD power couple? Why? Literally, KWD. you're gonna be gone soon. <gasps> you're you right. You'll be my what? wife. What I do? You'll be uh, married what to did me. Gabby, we can turn you into a really good producer if you come work with Gabby, I'm waiting for a ring. You should go over there. Gabby, let's get married. What's your name, dude? Let's get out of here. Bobby's mad at me. Steven. It's okay. Steven, Steven Mitchell. Steven. Defend my yeah. honor. Thank you. Happy to help, buddy. Steven, thank you, buddy. Bobby. Oscar, thanks for coming you. down. What? Fuck you. Hey! Don't, don't be mad at me. Dan, go out with Gabby. You. Gabby, we going to date with Dan. Sure. Check out what? what? Oh. You're not dating Dan. Oh, there it is. You're not going on a date with Dan. Remember this episode? Bobby. I said it first. You're not going on a date with Dan. Two years and it's real love. Two years and it's real love. It's going to be big. You know what, dude? This is going to be big. What's up, guys? Uh, Thank you so much for listening. If you want to come in as an audience member, email ykwdproducer at riotcast.com. If you want to send us fan art, love letters, um, personal photos, uh, send it to 117 McDougal Street, New York, New York. And don't forget to uh, download Laughable for uh, iPhone. Uh, Make sure you can follow all your favorite, not just podcasts, but people who are on podcasts. You love the regulars. Uh, that's the best place to find everything they're gonna, ever going to be on. So um, you can also follow us on Instagram at uh, YKWDude Podcast. Please make sure you follow that one. It's the only one that's going to get updated at this point. YKWDude Podcast. Uh, follow Robert Kelly where he's going to be at at robertkellylive.com. And you can follow Gabby at Gabby is Brian on Instagram. And you could follow Mike and Mike V. Suarez. Um, that's it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>